There we go. My mic's not muted, at least. We got that going. You know what? Let me put on some... Well, I know I'm live there. Is my YouTube live? My YouTube live? Yeah, it's live. Cool. Pop out chat. Bring this back. Cool. All right. Let me... That looks good. Properties... Okay, get my camera, cord. All right, where's my OBS? Uh, yeah, I need to, what I need to do is start making like a, a playlist where I can, <laughs> a playlist of some kind where I can put some, um, Copyright free, copyright free music. You know what I could do is doesn't like certain games do sell like um original soundtracks and I'm sure those are aren't those copyright free. So maybe we could do that. Oh, there you go. Hopefully that sounds good. Where's my OBS? You're not hearing it. <laughs> why am I? Why y'all not hearing it? Is that working? You guys hearing my you guys are hearing my music. Yeah. <laughs> oh man. Alright, I need to switch out the audio mixer. Um uh, this. Um blah, 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 blah. Yep, there it is. And then I put it for that. So there you go. But there you go. <laughs> Hi, Anna! I miss you! How's your Fortnite been? Big day today. We're gonna be playing mainly chill games today. So that's gonna be really fun and enjoyable. We're gonna start with uh, Sticker Tail. I died on the drums. Yeah, the drums are toughy. So many times. Yeah, no, I suggest doing vocals. What difficulty are you playing on? I'll definitely do that with you later tonight if you want. If you're awake when I'm done streaming, that is. You're playing on easy? Anna, I play on expert. Well, no, you're playing on keyboard. You're playing on keyboard, and that's hard. That's very, 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 very difficult. Um, so, no. On controller, I could do... Uh, what do you call? On controller, I can do expert but if i were to try on keyboard mm -mm. oh what's this jurassic world evolution is doing something else prepare to unleash our four new bioengineered hybrid dinosaurs wait a minute wait a minute what oh bioluminescent the bioluminescence is kind of cool but what makes like them different from like the other they're just bioluminescent I mean, that's cool. That's cool looking. Secret species pack. The Spinoceratops. Interesting. Stegoceratops. We, we already know about the Stegoceratops, no? Uh, is it just new dinos or is it new... It looks like just new... Uh, new dinos. Ankylodocus. Spinoraptor. I swear they've made this before. Spinoceratops. Didn't they do that for their first game? Let me look at their DLC for their first game, because I swear. It's like their Dr. Wu pack. Yeah. Oh, is this a Stegoceratops, not a Spinoceratops? But the Bioluminescent skins are cool. Huh. Alright. So the plan is, we're just going to play a little bit of everything today. Obviously, we're going to be doing chill games, nothing scary. Scary's for tomorrow. Um, going to be honest with you, don't know how long I'm going to be on. My leg freaking hurts. I have two ice packs on me, so we'll see how long I last. <laughs> uh, let me get, there we go, some nice music. Nope, no spoilers. No spoilers! I spoiled myself. And then I can turn that off. 
We're doing a scary game tomorrow. I'm gonna stock up on snacks. Yeah, scary games are usually like Tuesdays and then Fridays and Saturdays. Friday is kind of like a mix up. Saturday is for sure scary. Friday is like whatever I want to do, I guess. <laughs> well, but that's basically every stream, but like Friday is kind of like a mix up like Monday, but more it could be scary as well. But my Monday is my dedicated, like, we're not, we can't scare everyone away. All right, let's see what this is all about. Uh, wait, 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 I need to turn off my music. Here we go. A tiny sticker tail. Oh. Nice. How's the volume? Volume looks good on my end. I'll just maybe lower it a little bit. All right, new game. This game looks really cute. It's like a really, really cute puzzle game. Oh, she's pretty. Chica? Oh, here we go. Hello, can I talk? The time has come. A new adventurer awaits you. Remember that you can move some elements in sticker mode. To advance, try to move those boxes. Can I pick anything up as a sticker? <gasps> Kidnapping! Ah! <laughs> uh, okay, yeah, 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 yeah. I mean, do I wanna... I'll just take... I wanna take the crab. We're gonna collect all the animals we find. That That's for sure. Oh, maybe this is like all, I, all this room I have. Okay. So there we go. Bye! Oh, she belongs there. Hold on. I do have to pick you up. Come with me. There you go. Alright, and then... Yeah! Wait, let's make it perfect. There we go. It looks like that the plant at the north is blocking the path. I've heard that crabs can get rid of that kind of plant. Try bringing the crab near the plant to see if the path can be cleared. Remember, you can bring me with you for advice. Uh, yeah, I am- you're my- you're my child now. And then, I already have the crab, because I plan on collecting- Nice! Get back in my pocket. Sweet! Can I- Can I take the boat? I cannot take the boat. Okay. So what's up here? Ooh! <gasps> Is that Anna? Anna the raccoon? What? He's a sticker thief! Wait! I'm supposed to be the only sticker thief! Why is he taking all the trees? Do I have to... Uh. What the heck, man? Alright, can we put the trees back? Oh, we can. He just, he just threw them off into the abyss. Okay. Hello! This is my favorite place to relax, under the shade of the trees. But that raccoon took them. Could you help me plant five trees back here? Can't I just put these back? One, two, three. Actually, I'll move this one. Three. No, I'll move this one. I don't know where to move it. Three. Okay, so I need to find two more trees. Was there trees back here? Oh, here we go. Four, four, and then five. There we go. Here's four, and then five. Thank you very much. Hey, could you return this tool to the carpenter? I sure will. Thank you. You're welcome, lady. All right, what's going on over here? Whoa, she looks cool. Hello. Oh, it's nighttime here. Oh, an apple. I'll take the apple. You never know when we get hungry. Take that. There we go. We don't need any of those trees or bushes. All right, hello. My beautiful pond is dirty. Do you think you could clean it with my fishing rod? I've tried, but I haven't been able to. He to able to. Here, take it. Oh, thank you. You just have to throw the rod on the top of, on top of the object you want to remove from the bottom. You just have to throw the rod on top of the object you want to remove from the bottom. What? Oh, okay. 
Oh, thank you for taking out the trash. You know what? You can keep the fishing rod. Only if you promise to bring five fish to my pond. Uh, okay, yeah. Five fish to your pond. Yeah, I'll totally do that. <gasps> Ooh, a sloth. Wait a minute. This is, there's so much going on. <laughs> I'm gonna get so overwhelmed. Secret gifts. I don't know anything about that. Wait, hold on. Dang. Unrecognized code. Uh, what is that? A little music thing. I want to see hello. Hi, hi, sloth. Wisdom, strength, and power. This is the way. Okay. Is that... Alright, that's all you gotta say. Alright. Whoa. Hey, look, another apple. I'm sure these apples are gonna be used for something. Hey! Uh, wait. Can I use the... Mm. Alright, yeah. You're funny. Thank you. I'll figure it out. That little rat. Can I throw one of my apples? Okay, so that's her. That's fish lady. Another apple. Oh, that statue is super cute. Look at that. Rachel and Daniel, 11, 3, 23. That's so freaking cute. Can we keep it? It's ours now. Oh my gosh, hold on. We gotta do some space management. There we go. That is super freaking cute. And it looks like... I don't know, like a bridge is supposed to be there? Oh! Hello. Can I fish here? No. Okay, so I have to fish somewhere with like a fish icon. Got it. Hello, young one. I no longer have the strength to water my favorite plant. Would you help this old lady water the plant? You just have to take the bucket, fill it from the lake, and pour the water over the plant. Well, that's easy enough. Sure thing, old lady. There you go. Oh, beanstalk? Thank you. That type of plant also works as a ladder. When I was young, we used to water that plant to climb up the mountains. Oh. That's a little hinty hint. Okay. Wait, no. Give me this. Hold that, Mr. Crab. Can we go in the house? No. There's nothing here to fish. Oh, a raccoon passed by? He told me that if I saw the sunrise on the beach, something magical would happen. Can you take me to the beach viewpoint to see the sunrise? Oh, I just have to place you there? I forgot I could just, like, pick up people. Alright, you're with me now. I'll take you to the beach. What is this? A band? What? Do I have to find music? Okay, so we've seen her. And the beach should be... Yeah, so do I put her beach viewpoint? Up here? Is this good? Does that make you happy? Raccoon Puff has, he told me if I saw the sunrise on the beach. Could you take me to the beach viewpoint? Is this not the beach? No, 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 no. Is this not the beach viewpoint? Okay. Hang on, lady. The mailbox. Hidden at night. The bridge. The cliff. I'm trying to see if anything says like the viewpoint. Fish pond. The mailbox. Okay. So I just made a circle. Hello. Greetings, traveler. I'm a wandering merchant. I love to explore the world while collecting regional items. If you have such treasures, I'd gladly trade them for items in my collection. I need to be in my tent where I can show you how it all works. Oh, I need to put them in the tent. I forgot. <laughs> okay, wait, hold on. I want... What am I gonna give up? Here, I'll put her down for now. Chill out. Ah, so you're in the search of your father? Yes, I have indeed seen them. In fact, it seems that he left you some letters of important information throughout the island. Don't forget to read them all. But I don't know the code. Alright, you come with me. And we're gonna go in your freaking shop. There you go, you want to be right here. Cool. Allow me to show you how my humble shop works. In the rear, you'll find the wares I offer. A hat. And here, the humble price I seek in exchange. Once you place the required items, the trade will be completed. And you can claim the rewarded item in the center of this room. As a token of goodwill, allow me to offer you as a sample. 
Kindly take this item and place it to make your first trade with me. Oh, you want I, I got oh I got apples, bro. Do I have it? Can I wear it? Thank you. <laughs> trade complete. Go ahead and try on that hat. It'll look great on you. Oh, can I hat wear? Put it on me. Yeah! A charming hat indeed. My wares are, without a doubt, the finest quality. Outfits are divided between the body and the head. I've included a special magic sticker to remove the hat when you need to. Be sure not to lose it. Cool. Okay. So we could just, like, choose? Oh. Little cosmetic shop. Ooh. Maybe we need that in the future. Ooh, cute little co Ooh. And then it loops back around. Hmm. I like the bow tie. And I have an apple for it. Yeah. Yeah. Put it on. Oh, he looks so cute. And then we'll put our hat there. And then let's see what else we got going that can match. Um, I'm not really seeing. We could match with that. We need a shell, acorn, and a barrel. That's a whole lot. All right, we'll leave it hovered over that so we remember. What's over here? Another shop. Do I put him there? Dude, you got so much going on in your place. Come here. What else are you selling? What is this place? Show me. Oh, decoration? Okay, so Halloween decoration. Interesting, to say the least. And then Christmas decor. Is this game- is this like a live game? I didn't realize that it would do all that. Oh, there's a shell. How much- what do we need for the outfit that we want? We need- oh, he's not here. Um, get out of my freaking bag. Here. Uh, for the outfit I need, I wanted a shell, acorn, and barrel. Okay, I'm gonna put my crates down. I don't think I really need these crates for the time being. I don't think I need the trash either, <laughs> but I don't know where to put the trash. Maybe I'll put the trash by the mailbox. Here, I'll put I'll put it like right there. Yeah. Okay, so she needs to go to a viewpoint still. I don't know where I'm gonna find this viewpoint. We're still missing. We haven't gone up here. Oh, shooting gallery. Oh, take another shell. And bush that Ooh. a weapon. Okay. Hello. You need an arrow to play. Get an arrow and shoot with the crossbow. Alright, I don't have an arrow, so I'll see you later. <gasps> the viewpoint! <gasps> the letter! And barrels! We need these for our thing. I'll just collect all three, because I already forgot. And then one more. There we go. Okay, Grandma! Enjoy the view! This is a magic moment. Look! Here comes the sunrise! Ah! Cute! Whoa! A balloon? What is that? This medallion pre represents joy! This means you have helped someone in need and learned the great virtue of enjoying all the good moments. Aww! Oh, I want to take it. That's so cute. Yeah. Can I keep the... Oh my gosh, I can take the sun. I wonder if I need the sun for something. Oh. I'll leave the sun. Thank you for bringing me to this beautiful moment. There's one more wish I would like to fulfill. There's an observation deck at the northeastern edge of here. I would like to go back. I was there when I was young. Okay, now I have to freaking take you back. All right. Hi, Bora! Thank you for the lurk! Alright, let's see this. Hello, my child. I'm glad you came. I'm glad you brought your sticker album as I asked. It's very special in this place, I'm sure you, are, you already noticed. In addition to using your album to take objects from the world, you can also see the collection of stickers you have taken. You can explore the island and fill your collection. I will see you later. For now, go to the mountains. Love you, Dad. Are we gonna go backstory? We are! He's so cute! 
My little baby? Teaching me the ways of the world? Oh, my sticker book. <laughs> yeah! Pass over that book, Papa. I got it. Good lore moment. We needed that lore. Alright, sweet. Let us... Oh, so J Collection. Ah. Okay, cool. Oh, wow. There's 22 pages. That's insane. So, nothing here that we need. Oh, the crates are here. Um, hello. My dream is to reconnect the island. I was working on a project that uh, would accomplish this. But my saw disappeared. Only with a saw will I be able to finish my project. Okay, here you go, buddy. Thank you for finding my Louis shirt teeth. With it, I will be able to finish my project. <gasps> oh, I can create objects and furniture for you. For this, I need you to bring different trees near my workshop. With your magic, you can bring a tree and place it uh, there at the mark. Okay, but what would it make? Like, if I gave you this. With this first tree, I will make a special gear. It is the gear that the mill requires to work. A mill? Where was a mill? I haven't seen a mill. Alright, <laughs> take this gear to the owner of the mill to have it repaired. With the light generated from the mill, I will be able to work the following pieces of furniture. Uh, Alright, yeah. I'll take it. Dude, I don't have room for this. Oh, I don't have room. Alright, we'll deal with the bridge later. Whoa. <gasps> the raccoon! Oh, okay. Yeah, nice going. Yeah, that's so funny. Alright, yeah, you're hilarious. Yeah, yeah, thank you. Great. Oh, who wants to be here? Not her. Some monkey? Monkey wants to be here. Have we met a monkey? Here, let's catch this thing. Oh! Oh, it's one of those, like, sea angels. Oh, that's so freaking cute. And we can go put that by, um, that lady. Oh, she's adorable! Oh, maybe this is where the bridge goes. Okay, and that looks like something I gotta water. Alright, man. Oh, and that's the mill! Oh, look at the axolotl dude! Oh, he looks so cool! Wait, she wants to come here? Okay. Alright, can I turn in this... I'm so confused. Um, I need to go here. Yes, she wants... There you go. That's fish number one. And then I need to go in this shop. And then, can I pay for my outfit? I need an acorn. Alright, I'm gonna drop off my apples here. You're, you're not gonna steal, right? I need to make room. So I'm gonna just drop off everything I have here that I don't need right now. Keeping the medallion with me, I'll keep put my clothes here with him. I'll keep my crab. I d the statue's taking a lot of room too. I'm probably gonna have to get rid of the statue. Now I'll put these there. Okay. Sweet. So now I just need to find me self an acorn. And then she needs to come with me. She wants to go up. And then... Let's see... Do I need to bring, like, the sun with me to fish in different areas? It's almost seeming like it. Alright, what do you want, lady? Some time ago, I met someone who had a book. Similar to yours, full of stickers. Does your book also have a collectible album? It does. It does he do. Alright, come with me. I don't know what else you wanted me to do. Uh, why was I give you this other tree? What are you gonna do about it? Excellent, with this tree, I can create a new piece of furniture for you. What are you gonna make me? A stool! If you have a house, it can help you- I can have a house in this game? Wait! This game is way more- way more in detail than I thought. Okay, I need to fit this bridge in my inventory. So let's push everything I can up. Maybe, like, like so. Okay, this bucket needs to go down. This needs to go, like, all the way up. Then we'll shove this there. Oh, it doesn't fit. There. There. And then she's in the freaking way. Maybe she can be there. And then... Yes! 
All right. Let's get this bridge going. The bridge obviously goes here. There we go. And then we use the bucket. Water that. Nice. And now we can climb. What's the lever for? Wait. Can we, like, make it bigger? No. Uh-huh. So what am I- how am I supposed to get up there? What's this, like, little statue thing? No idea. Hello! I like to play with my friend. He is like my little brother. That's cute! Whoa. Whoa. <gasps> A doggy! Did he start following you? That's so cute! I love animal companions. Wait, that's not weird, right? Ah, I mean, you are kind of an animal. Nice flag, though. Who are you? By the way, did you hear about the new Pe Petrian Pod Podacy game coming out? I'm so excited. It's a real hidden gem, if you ask me. Kind of like that dog was. <laughs> okay. So I just have a doggy following me. Oh, never mind. Doggy? Wolf. Is he following me? Oh, hello. My sister hid near the mountain. If you help me find her and bring her back, I can give you an arrow we took from the shooting gallery. Now, are you talking about this girl over here? Is she the one that you view as your sister? We'll see. Is it her? Thank you very much! Take what I promised you! Nice! It was! Okay, so now we can go back to the- My freaking ice pack fell. We can go back to the shooting gallery. Hold on, I need to get- Oh, I need to get my ice pack. My freaking foot hurts. Okay. Uh, got it? Got it? Alright, we're situated. And what is this for? This button statue thingy? And what is this little hole for? Alright, what do you want, lady? Oop, my bad. What do you want? I would like to unlock the railway path, but I need something explosive. I can break small rocks. The entrance to the mountains is blocked with small rocks. With enough light, I can handle those kind of rocks. You're coming with me. All right. And I'll take this arrow. And I can go back to the beach now. Oh, I'm over here. And this is the guy who wants the gear. Okay. Hello. I need to explore the desert. There is a very interesting oasis. But first, I have to repair the mill. I need a gear to repair it and recover the electricity. I have that. Here you go. Finally, we have electricity thanks to the windmill. Now I recommend you to, uh, I recommend you explore the desert. It is also said that there are hidden jewels of a giant there. <gasps> there we go. Is it gonna? Yeah. Oh, is that me? You made that for me. Thank you. What am I gonna do with this? Uh, it's nice and all, but it's freaking massive. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Hold on. No, 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 no. I don't want to talk to you. Sorry. Let me adjust everything that we got going on here. Nope. I don't even know why I have this flag. I just got it because it was cute. Let's maybe put the flag up there for her here. There we go. All right. We got our statue. <laughs> why? I don't know. Oh, the bridge can go here. Oh. That's not that too. It's not too hard because I can literally just go over here. What was that exclamation mark? Oh, I'm sitting! <laughs> I was sitting on the stump, that's cute. Let's see, monkey, you wanna go here? Right? I'm old, I can't see at night anymore. I could break a few small rocks, but only in daytime. Okay, and that's when I bring the sun over, right? And the sun is right here. No one's using it. I could just manhandle my way through. Here you go. Nice and shiny. It's time to work. <laughs> there we go. Easy. And then what's this little sign here? You're like, there we go. What's this sign? To the mount. Oh, okay. And then what does she want? It is said that there is a very reactive mineral on the way to the forest. I always wanted to explore it. I think I can mine it. You're coming with me. Okay, so let's see what's in here. 
Whoa. It's more of these little statue things. And that's missing a tooth. <gasps> Another note! What's this say? You shall not pass! The Great Conqueror. Aww. Cute reference. Alright. Hello, my child. I'm glad you made it here. On this island, there are five very important medallions. I think we have one of them. Make sure to collect them all, my little one. In these mountains, there is an old friend searching for her son. Could you help her? Here's also a gift. This map will be useful. Also, if you use it with your collectible album, you'll be able to see the location of all the stickers. I'll see you later in the forest. Love you, Papa. Thank you, Papa. More lore? Oh, he's teaching us how to use it. That's cool. It actually shows that it, like, shrinks down. Are those the medallions? We haven't seen that shield or that heart before. Thank you, Papa. Alright, so... Oh, no, 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 no. Please don't tell me you're gonna... No! Don't bring me back! <laughs> don't bring me... I don't need to go back! I get it. Yes, 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 yes. Alright, let's make sure we're not... Can we move? There we go. Wow. Okay. So we've explored almost half. That's really weird looking. Can I bring this map with me? Oh, I can't. Okay. Thank God. Uh, a ring? You're missing a ring. <gasps> a pine cone! I don't need a pine cone. I need an acorn. Okay. Oh. Can I water here? Oh, that person's frozen! <laughs> Wait a minute, that person's way frozen! I need water. Can this count? Let's go. Okay. Let's grab that. Let's go water. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I get it. Yes, 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 yes. Water. Nice. Take this back. Hello, you're frozen! I gotta heat you up somehow. I gotta get a campfire. A slide? That's super cute! Uh, it's blocked off. Mountain Rapids, jump in for a trip. We're missing someone, like a squirrel, maybe? Oh, hello! A puzzle piece is under there. It's dangerous here. The Great Eagle is very angry. It's looking for its egg. Even though, even it took a ladder I had. I suspect the egg can be found all to the way from the- to the east from here. Okay. English. Oh, I need to learn how to shoot! What? A foot? What are you doing with a foot? Oh, it's so funny. Oh, it's so funny. Alright. Guys into feet. We respect it. Another foot. Oh, it's darker over here. Ooh, it's windy. All right, can't go there. Need a ladder. Need to shoot that down. So I think I need to go to, like, the range. And get that situated. I'm also missing out on some sort of lookout, right? There's another way up here. The lost sun. Oh, is that the egg? Is the egg the sun that's lost? Okay. It's in the mountains. Carpentry. Alright, where was that girl who... There she is. Yeah, arrow to play, get an arrow, shoot the crossbow. I got one! Here you go. And then... Do I have to time it? Oh, I do. Okay. I gotta do it a little earlier. There we go! Right on target! You passed the test! Now it's time for the real challenge! Talk to me again and the game will start. Sure, what's up? Let the game begin! You have 15 seconds to get as many points as you can! Okay. Uh... Nope, too late. There we go. Nope, too late. No, too- I'm doing it too freaking late! Awesome! Your score was one! Hi, Levi. If you get more points, I'll give you something. What do you want? <sighs> okay. I have 50 seconds. Maybe I need to, like, back it up just a little bit. Come on, pick it up. It's not- It's not letting me pick up the arrow! This is cheating. It won't let me pick up the arrow. The arrow's stuck? 
zero stuck? My score was zero. Okay. Wait, why is the... I can't pick up the arrow. Ma'am. Maybe I need to like... The arrow is stuck. Hold. I'm holding. It, yeah, it won't let me grab the sticker. What happened? I need this, by the way. Thank you. Sorry, you could be cold. Uh, have this flag. I don't know what you're gonna do with it, but um, yeah, thank you. I. It's stuck. <laughs> oh, maybe I'm supposed to shoot back here. <laughs> you know, where I was supposed to. Uh, do I have to restart the game? Okay, let's see. Continue. There we go. All right. Now we go. Now we're cooking with gas. All right. Let's see. One. Why did I do that? Oh, that was so close. Two. No. I need like I probably just need three. All right. Let's try again. Dang it. Dang it. <laughs> One. Oh my gosh. This ain't- no, this ain't it. This ain't it. Yep, one. Alright. Dude, how perfect do I have to be at this? No, I don't need a piece- Oh, it's over. It's over. Okay, let's try again. Alright. One. No. <laughs> oh my gosh. Fifteen seconds is- What do you want me to do? I'm probably gonna put it closer. All right, all right. It's going. It's going back to being closer again. One. Dang it! <laughs> I'm cheating and I can't even do it. You know what? What if I put it to like just like one side? Wait, hold on. Let me talk to her again. Oh my gosh, the arrow's broken again. <laughs> this sucks. All right, I got this. I got this. I got this. Yes, yes, uh, yes, yes. I know. I know. I know. One. Dang it. Two. Ah. Three. I got three. The score was three. Take this. Let's go. Oh. Really? I worked for that. I don't need any more statues. I got a crab. I don't need any more statues. Thank you. What am I gonna do with these? Maybe I'll make a room. Maybe I'll maybe I'll have a dedicated space for all of my glory. That's all I'll do. Where's some where's some clear property? I need to get away from all these people. This is a clear property. This is kind of clear. Oh yeah, that's it too. Yeah, we're, we're gonna take this out. Okay, so this will be our property. We're gonna put the love one there because that one's super cute. I love it. We're gonna move this one, this old one. This old one could go up with whatever the people are. Go here. You'll love it. There you go. Nice new spot for you. All right. And then I'm gonna put all my statues of all my glory. There we go. Here we go. All right. This will be my room, my dedicated space. Now, let's see. Come on, just land properly. There you go, look cool. Uh, still need to catch five. What is that raining? It needs to rain for a waterfall effect, maybe? Uh, mailbox, don't need anything. I don't know what that music symbol's for. Why are you like that? There you go. Hidden at night. Well, I can't, I, I don't have a moon yet. That guy broke that. So let's just go up to the campfire and put the campfire down. That's probably our best bet. Um, up here. Yeah, there we go. Let's put the campfire over up here, if I'm right. Yeah, let's put it on this dude. I'll save you! Yeah! You're welcome! Thank you! Brother? Your name is Brother? Wisdom, strength, and power. This is the way. I'm gonna take you to your friend. Someone I know says the exact same thing. 
And then there's a puzzle piece here. Yeah. How do I take- Oh, I fish it out. I fish it out. Like that. So wait. Another piece to the puzzle. And then let's take this. Alright. So... Here... I need to shoot... I freaking forgot! <laughs> I forgot to get my bow and arrow! I'm a professional. I, need, I want to take this guy to the sloth anyways. He needs to stop being cold, so maybe that'll help. Alright, where's my stuff? Maybe I should take this sun with me. This sun could be mighty useful. And I'll take this tree with me. Let's see what the guy does with this tree. Because I know he made a stool. Alright, what are you going to do with this tree? Excellent, with this tree I can create a new piece of furniture. Is that it? Okay, you're just making furniture. Here's a new piece of furniture, I hope you like it! If you have a house, it can help you decorate. I don't have a house, I'm homeless. Um, Not here. You, do you want anything? No, I, I'm not playing this game with you. No, please, save me. No, I'm running away, thank you! Um, Over here, down beach. Is this your brother? Look! Are you guys happy? Okay, that will be your hangout spot because I don't know what to do with you guys. All right, now that we got the arrow, can we do anything with this flower? This flower looks mighty pretty. I'll keep that. Um, nothing we could do there. That's not our house. What does that sign say? What does it say? I already forgot. Water plant, okay. All right. I'm trying to figure out like if anything indicates fishing. We have yet to see like a big indicator for fishing. So, all right. No fish here in this water. No fish here in this water. So let's go up. That's where that guy is. Okay. Something about like the freaking bird took his ladder, and that's why we can't use it. can't go in the house and like what's with these like what are these do I have to water that why don't we water those okay we can't Did the water freeze over already no all right we just can't get from there that's fine all right let's try to shoot this thing down ready aim fire let's go oh what are you you're mine what are you? Let me talk to you. Okay. You're just mine. Do you follow me? No, you're useless. Alright, but you're in my pocket now, so that's all that matters. We love kidnapping here. Uh, no, give me this. There we go. Give me this. There we go. Alright. Anything over here? No. I don't know how we're gonna get through that. And we need a ladder. Hermit. The snow. Hmm. Map. Where's our map? Let me look at the map again. Maybe we just maybe we just need some guidance here. Hmm. Have we tried the bridge here? I could try putting the bridge here. I just don't have any access to like making it nighttime right now. I I haven't seen a moon. Mountain water. And then there's this thing. Like, how do we get up here? Maybe we put her up here? Hey, can you flip that for me? No. You're mighty useful. What do we how do we get that lever to flip? Can any can hey, can you can you flip that for me? No. You're a doll. I have no freaking clue. Okay, and we have a puzzle piece too. <gasps> doggy, what do you want, doggy? What do you want? What, what, what's your thing? I already forgot. Uh. Doggy, you're coming with me. I don't know why. And the flag and the. Oh man. And what goes here? I 
Mr. Axolotl, I'm a little lost. Hmm. I mean, he's just making furniture. There's nothing going on here. I wish I had like a quest thing to keep me on track. What do you want? Five fish. Yeah, I'm trying. I'm trying. Okay. It's very difficult. And here, there's just nothing but clothes for sale. Like, oh my gosh, I don't even have room to put them in. Hmm. Doesn't really seem useful. I mean, what else could I be possibly missing? Hidden at night. Yeah, I need nighttime, so like if I put the sun out. Quite the opposite. I'm about to put the sun out everywhere I go at this point. No. Up here. Oh, man. There's no one who could flip the lever for me. The diamonds are pouring items, don't lose them. The mother is searching for her child. Perhaps the old hermit knows something. Okay, so let's just go back to the old hermit. And she blows that up. Can we go across this? No. I think the bridge is actually too small for that, too. Alright, let's go revise what the old hermit told us. Maybe he'll actually say something that I'll remember and cherish. Because I don't remember anything. Um, hermit. 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 Hey, buddy. It's dangerous here. The eagle's very angry. Look for its egg. Even it even took a ladder I had. I expect the egg can be found all all to the way to the east from here. Yeah, it's hard to get east. Like, what am I supposed to do with the wind? The wind's a little difficult. Please, I need a daytime. Make my life easier. Or was I just? No, see, like, the wind pushes. Behind rocks, it's fine. Oh, wait! Can I? Ah, oh, I see, I see, I see, I see, I see, I see. Okay, so I need a place. Everyone get out of my inventory. Everyone leave. No, I don't need you to talk to me. Everyone, everyone out. Out. You're all banished. Banished! You were all bad, very bad people. Yes, give me the f the foot was here for a reason. Boom! Now we have yes. Oh my gosh, it's all coming together. <gasps> the egg, the egg, and the old lady can rest. Here, here you go. Bye. I never thought I would return to this place. The this moment is beautiful. Look at this. What a beautiful sunset. <gasps> the moon! You made this elderly woman happy. Oh, I'll take that moon, though. Oh. That's super pretty, though. Alright, old lady. Enjoy your time. Alright, there we go. Okay. Alright, let me bring all of you back in. Starting with you, Chica. Then monkey lady. Then my crossbow. My flower that I'm keeping for no apparent reason. My... No! My bucket! No, okay. My bucket can go here. And my map here. Alright, now we're cooking with gas. So, we just put the egg back on the nest and it should be fine, right? I'll see, uh... Anything else we can do and then he'll give us the ladder? Here you go! Hello? Hey! Whoa! You're pretty! <gasps> the heart! Where's the ladder, though? This medallion represents love. This means you have helped someone in need and learned the great virtue of love and friendship. Let's go! Yeah, there it is! <laughs> Thank you! Oh, I can take you! Should I? I mean, you just... You enjoy your baby. It's been a while, you know? Catch up with it, you know? Tell it all the stories you need to tell it. Um, so let's... Oh gosh, I don't have room. Oh, I do now. 
And let's get this heart medallion. There we go. Okay. So let's go and put the ladder. I thought it was over here, right? It was around here? Oh, hello. Ah, you got the ladder. You need to climb up and down low walls. With it, you'll be able to reach the forest. People say it's a nice view. However, when you feel sad, uh, like I feel, everything is gray. Maybe a pet will make me feel better. I feel so lonely. If you want to search for a sticker on the map, you can do so. Open the album and use the sticker finder on a sticker you already took. Here, buddy! Pupper! Ha! A puppy! He seems to like me. Can I keep him? Really? Now I don't have to be alone anymore. Oh, that's so cute. Dang it. All right, so what happens if I, like, put the sun and the moon at the same spot? Uh, ooh, eclipse? Okay, so let's, um, adjust everything to fit this statue that we have now acquired. I realized, nope, I realized we can put stuff like, okay, we can't put stuff too far in the corner. And then there, and then there, and then there, and then there. Can I get my sun back? Can I get my moon back? Oh, the moon might be a tight fit. I can move the map, though, easily. And Mr. Crab. Alright, maybe not so much Mr. Crab, but it's fine. Mr. Crab can move up. Now I can get my moon. Alrighty, tidy. Enjoy your new pupper! Take this ladder. We're gonna bring this ladder wherever we go, because I feel like this ladder could be used in more than one spot. Um. Oh! Is this what the monkey was talking about? Luckily, I have you, Monkey Moo. It's time to work. <laughs> what are you gonna get? Oh, nice. Are you happy now? I'm happy to be useful and help despite my age. <laughs> All right, sweet. Thank you. Much appreciated, Monkey Lady. Goodbye. Another letter. And what's this? Is this my home? Wait a minute, do I live here? Oh my gosh, I actually have a house. What is this? Oh, that's to the backyard? Or front? What's this then? Well, you know, front and back, they do have exits, so... Alright, sweet, so I'll just, uh... Yeah. Right in the middle. That's the best one so far. Other than the lovebird one. And then we- Mr. Crab, you have a home now! Enjoy! And then I can put, like, my medals. I'll keep my medals. I feel like maybe they'll be useful in the end. I'll leave the campfire here, too. And then I'll have a sunroom? Yeah, I'll put the sun- <laughs> Maybe I should keep the sun, actually. I'll put my puzzle piece here, though. Don't really need that, yeah. And Mr. Crab, you can have a cupcake, because you've been so good. Okay. So, that's pretty good. I don't, I don't need this flower, either. I'll put the flower away in this room. There we go. Nice! And we have a bed. And we have stuff. And my ice pack just fell. Gosh dang it. Um... So we actually do have a place to, like, take care of ourselves. That's nice, though. I still need an acorn to find my outfit. Oh, there's an acorn right there. Hello, my child. Without a doubt, you are very intelligent. Thank you. Uh, have you already met my old friend, the raccoon? Don't take it to heart. He's just playful. There's a little boy who wants to be a musician and needs a push. Could you help him? By the way, here in the forest, I left my tent take it you can decorate its interior and take it with you i'll see you later in the desert to the east of here love you dad we can take the tent that's awesome oh we're playing catch 
I love you, Papa. I hope you're well. Yeah. Nice catch. Good throws, too. Good throws. Good arm. Papa is still healthy. <gasps> my tent! My home! And my acorn! No! <laughs> no, this is not what I meant to do. Alright. Yeah, yeah, we get it. We get it, Papa. Good memories. Acorn! Yes! We can go buy our outfit! We can go look stylish now. <gasps> Puppy? Will he be mad if I take the puppy? Oh no, I don't want Mr. Man mad at me if I have to take his puppy. Oh, this is so kind of confusing. Whoa. All right, we are getting place to places. Um, Actually, since I have my tent, I am gonna leave the metals in my tent just so I can have more space. I think that's the best bet. Um, We'll put my stuff in. Just all the spare stuff right now. Actually, we'll put the medals out there because they look really pretty. They're really pretty. There we go. Nice. Okay. Um. Yeah, I'm just gonna just make space. Can she be in here? There's a turtle boy that I know wants to be a musician. I was worried that someone was drowning. <laughs> what? You're just gonna casually mention someone drowning? Okay, so we'll just keep all that. Sweet. And then we'll pick, take the tent with us. Bada bing. We're gonna go back and maybe get that... Oh, maybe we should get that dog. Alright, let's talk to Crocoon. Hello! H hello Science is the magic... Science is the magic of the intelligent. There's a mineral nearby that can be used to, be, to create something very explosive. Are you talking about the mineral that I just put away? Oh, is my home not? Is my home not? Can my no home not be here? Is this is this bothersome? There we go. I just put that away. I could just kidnap people. <laughs> like she's just here. Is this what you want? Yeah, you found it. Give it to me and I will give you something explosive. Use this bomb with responsibility and keep it out of reach of children. You can break big rocks that have cracks. Thank you. Can I kidnap you? I would love it. You want to be my friend? Live in my house? It's a big house. There you go. Nice. Yeah, just like the one you just broke. Thank you. So you're chill now? Now it only remains to wait for my old friend and partner, Earl. Oh, you're with someone. He lives in the lonesome village. Alright, I, I won't kidnap you then, if you're, uh, taken. Shame. Shame, we could've had a good love. We could've, we could've been a thing. But, you know, you had to be with Earl. Whoever that is. Who are you? Hello! Wisdom, strength, and power. This is the way- Ooh, I should have you guys in my house! Just the big old monk crew. Come on, you're going in my house and you're a possum. <gasps> Where's my possum? No! Oh, Pig is not here. This is sad. Wait, I need to get Pig. Pig! I'm sorry, Pig. I'm sorry. I should have had you here from the beginning. Pig uh, was resting. She was so resting. She needed rest. She was tired of hanging on. You know what I'm saying? Come on, Pig. Ugh. Yeah. All right. Yeah, we should have these guys, like, surround, like, a statue. Yeah, that's cool. That's cool looking. And let's have the fairy, like, with her. That's cute. Okay. Just enjoy- Now I'm enjoying decorating. <laughs> Alright, let's take our humble abode with us. Let's blow this up. Nice. That's uh, another thing for us. Now we're just- Oh! Oh, sweet! Shh. Shh. They'll be fine. They're gonna be happy together. They can be in... I need to like make like a playful, pretty area. Maybe this area will be it. Yeah. 
You guys can be with Mr. Crab and the cupcake. Yeah. 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 It's all happy in here. <laughs> and we'll give you guys a campfire too. Just so you guys have some sort of warmth in this side of the tent. There you go. See, it's fine. And they could have the flower too if they wanted. Alright. I'm gonna... I, well, no, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine. I'll decorate later when it matters. Okay, so... Axolotl. Kidnapping you. It's fine. <laughs> Just a little kidnapping. Come on now. Can I put the ladder up here? See, that was like something I was like... Yes! Yes! Oh. Whoa, I didn't want you. I didn't think we were gonna get another puzzle piece. Okay. Sweet. Uh, let's see, what else? Key. More letters. Should I take the letters with me? You're coming with me. <laughs> I'm not just kidnapping everyone that I see. What are you talking about? You're coming with me. <laughs> everyone can come with me. We're gonna have a great time. Yeah, let me get my statues. Alright, so... We're just gonna have a great party. We'll do a party in this room. Yeah, alright, so here we go. Here's the... Put a flower on it. Oh, I can't put a flower on it. Alright, we'll put a flower there. Then we'll put... I don't know, these people talking. And then this person is just chilling over here. Let's go. See, everyone's having a grand old time. <laughs> it's not that bad. Alright, let's get these statues in. Uh, let's see. Dang it. Okay, let's get this. I'm gonna have to move my bed. I don't need a bed, okay? I'm literally just a traveler. That's all I do with my life is travel. Okay, let's get another one. This corner. Let's get the big- this one's super cute. I love it. They knew what they were doing. Alright, let's put it there, maybe? Put it there. And then this one can actually just be a centerpiece of this room. Yeah, that looks good. All right, that looks good. All right, look at that. And now we can go to the store and buy the um the outfit. Yeah, I know. I still need to do that. You guys, coming with me? Oh, do I not have room? Oh shoot. My house does not have room. Well, I'm about to use these acorns. Alright, let's shop! I have- oh, that was it. Wasn't this it? Oh, I can dress up as one of the monks? That would be funny. Let's get this outfit. I like it. It's really cute. Uh, acorn. Seashell. Barrel. Yes! Thank you! Thank you! Oh, I look so cute. Okay, um, you might need to buy that. And I do have a crate outside, so I'll just snag this crate and then buy this pole. I don't know if we're gonna need it. But it looks like it might be something useful. Nice, okay. Yeah, we'll buy this, keep this. And then let's put the acorn down. Take the monks. Yeah. <laughs> Casual kidnapping, it's fine. Nighttime here. What's gonna happen here? Oh, sparkles. What's sparkles for? I don't know how to handle that. to 
to do? Okay, I don't know. We'll figure that out later. Um, oh, we can uh, explode that rock, but I don't know what it's going to do for us because we still can't get across. <gasps> Another one of those thingies that I have no idea about. Yeah, I'll take you. Add you to my collection. Alright, can we put my house down here? It, it can't. What, what's happening? Why can't it? Is it too small? Too tiny of a space? Oh, that's the turtle. We definitely need to go back to the forest. That's a fact. Can I put my stuff down here? There we go. Alright. Let's move her. I'm actually gonna move her over. This pole can just, like, be here for now. Oh! It's a flag! I wasn't expecting that. Like, it, it, to have a pole. Alright, you're gonna be in this room. Flag there. Maybe flag behind it. Yeah, that looks cool. And then she can be... Yeah, I know. Someone's drowning. I get it. But you're gonna be with the little fairies. Because I think they're cute. Yeah! Cool. And then I have the monks. <laughs> and the monks can chill out here. Let's go! I'm collecting them all. Sweet! My town in a town is working out. Now we gotta go across here. Let's see. Kidnap you. Uh, go in here. Yep, and this is where we were. Whoa! Whoa! Let's play. It's easy. You just have to place the racket and bounce the ball. Ready? Let's start. Uh. Okay. Uh, nope. That's not it. There we go, that was a hit, that was a hit. Okay, okay. Ooh, it's going faster. Is that gonna hit it? Let's go. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, you're not gonna beat me at this. Ain't no way I'm gonna let you beat me. Ooh, nice, that was fun. That was a lot of fun, in intruder. Thanks for playing. I have to go make some more jokes. Why am I the intruder? Let's play later, okay? Yeah, sure, bud. But why am I the intruder? You're the one that's causing issues. Uh, do I want to take this racket? Not really. But we have another fish. We have another fish we can catch, finally. Uh, here we go. Fishy foo, I wish I could keep you. I can't. Alright, what's up here? Uh, that's where I got my house. Uh, hidden path. Whoa. This is gorgeous. Hello. Hello, sweetie. So you're one of the so you're the one who came from outside. It's lovely to have you here on the island. You know, some of my sisters are lost out there. Could you bring back four of my sisters to this place? But I want to keep your sisters! I'll just have to kidnap you right after! Oh, another fish right here. Here we go. Nice. Starfish. So we're, that's three now. Uh, for us. Do I need to get the bridge? No way the, no way the bridge can fit there. I could go across here though. But where'd he go? He didn't leave this way, did he? No. Huh. Odd little fellow that guy is. Oh, <gasps> you, you are drowning! <laughs> hey! Thank you for rescuing me! I was warned, but I didn't listen. Give me a life buoy and I'll tell you a secret. Okay, very demanding for someone who just saved your life. Um, sure, I'll give you a life buoy, just give me a bit. Uh, is there a reason I can cross this? Ooh, maybe I need a- Oh wait, no, I can- I'm fine. I'm swimming. 
That's a freaking manatee. Oh my gosh. She is so cute. I love her. I'm going to keep her and kidnap her for the rest of my days. Another flower, too. She's so cute! Hello, my name is Mary. Mary the manatee. I really could go for a cupcake. If you can bring me one, I'll give you a nice surprise. I have a cupcake. I have a cupcake. Mr. Crab has a cupcake, but, you know, he can he can go without. Hey, everyone. How you doing? Uh, I have another friend for you. There. Enjoy him. I also have another flower. Enjoy that. Alright. What do you got? Uh, here. Sorry, Mr. Crab. You gotta do what you gotta do. You want my map, though? I can give you my map. There you go. Enjoy that. Um, let's see. Here you go! For you! I didn't mean to go in my house. Yum! Thank you so much! As a reward, I want you to have some of my favorite things to decorate your house with. I hope you like them! <gasps> I love her! I'm gonna decorate you with my house, though. <laughs> Get in my house. My humble abode. Meet your new friend. She like- wait, hold on. Can you guys like look at each other? Act like you guys enjoy each other's presence. And then like, you guys can have the fl- the- the- Yeah. You guys can talk over here in this corner and be like the gossip girls, but nice. Yeah! And then these girls can fly. Okay, so I need four of those. Um, okay, sweet. She's so pretty, I love her. I need more manatee, uh, recognition. Like, Animal Crossing, but with manatees? Oh, that would be so cute. Okay, so we're four out of five now with the fishing. Got it. Un Whoa! Is that a hippo? What? You putting a sleeping sticker on a hippo? Oh, he's done for. <laughs> he eepin'. How the heck am I gonna wake this guy up? Thanks, Bozo! Good for nothing. What the frick am I gonna do? Okay, so he's blocking that path. Um, I don't know what I can do. Huh? Oh, these are where all my medals go! Okay, so I'm missing... Uh, three more medals. A book. Oh, there's more decoration here. I will use this. Yes, please. I will take all these. I will take all of them. They will fit perfectly in my house. What's this? Dear diary, I haven't managed to decorate my space yet, but I really like to be but I really like to be playing. I would like to be able to come one day and find at least 5 pieces of furniture in my space. You want me to use these? Is this your space? I'll use them, but I'm gonna take them, like, right after. Okay. Is this your space, lady? There you go. Ah, uh, excuse me! You better not. You better- Oh, no, you better don't. Don't you dare. He's gonna take them all, isn't he? Oh, intruder! Oh, so you did this for me, huh? You didn't have to do it. I was about to do it myself. Well, I guess, thank you? In return, I'll give you this life buoy I found lying around. Thanks, bro. Oh, can I not pick up any? Oh, I can't. <laughs> Who says this is for you, huh? I was just testing it out. And now I'm gonna put it in my house. Ever heard of it? He's chill now. He's just chilling. What do you want? Hey, intruder, do you happen to have any candy to spare? There's a crazy witch who makes delicious candies but doesn't give them away. If you manage to figure out how to get these candies, let me know. Can I actually just take you with me? I can. Because you have a quest, and I kind of don't want to come all the way back here just for the quest. So I'm actually just going to have you like... Yeah, that's so smart. I'm so smart. Guys, look, I have decor! You guys probably won't appreciate this decor. Uh, I have a this and a radio now that you can mess with. And that's it. I'm going to put the other stuff in the other room. Hey guys, I have decor. I got 
more plants. I got that, and I got that, and I got a chest. I don't think you guys are gonna care about that. And that's it. You know what? Let me take these stools over there. I want to decorate a little bit. Just a tiny, just a tiny, just a tiny. Stool there. Stool there. All right, everyone's having a good time. Sweet. Let me blinky, just blinky, and go up. Nothing's here. You want the buoy though. Here you go. Now I'll be safe. <laughs> Never let your guard down. The secret to wake up the sleepy hippo is the music. I'll see you in the mountains for a great dive. <gasps> ah, another medal. This medallion represents safety. This means you have helped someone in need and learned the great virtue of taking of taking care of yourself. Love it. All right, and I'm kidnapping you. Sorry. All right, so we need to get music. Oh, that's a turtle that we ha need to help. Okay, I'm not getting any of these flowers. These flowers are unnecessary. Is there anyone hiding behind these things? No. Uh, we could blow this up. <gasps> oh, I thought it broke the freaking thing. Oh, what a beautiful violin. Is it really for me? I will practice and be able to play in the town's auditorium. Okay, so I'm assuming I have to kidnap you. It's fine. It's fine. Just do that. Why is the tree like... Gosh, I move you one time and you freak out on me, huh? Can I move? Is this not gonna register? There we go. Alright. Let's go in here. Guys, I, get, I got you a new friend. Not this guy. I got you a new friend! Enjoy your time! And you need to go. Actually, you're gonna be placed somewhere, so it's fine. I love the fact that you can just pack your tent with you. That's such a cool concept. Can you play music in front of this guy? Is that what you're meant for? Okay, maybe not. Maybe I need to like get you going first. Alright, so we're three out of five now. Can I take the book? No. Alright, so wi a witch has a candy. <gasps> yes! Oh, life is easy. Oh, and I have one, two, three. Okay, one more for you. I know, I'll, I'll get it at some point. Siri, please don't. Uh, where is the stage? Actually, I want this love flag. That would be cute now for the house. Here we go. Oh, it looks like you're missing a friend. This would be the ideal place to play music if I weren't shy. If I had four specters, I would give it a try. Oh, I got four specters, all right. I got four. Uh, we're gonna do... Hey, guys! There's a show! Come on. Come one, come all to the show. Two. Uh, three. See, look at that. I was preparing. Four. Okay, there we go. And then let me... Can I replace this flag? Yes! That's super cute. Here you go. Does this count? Yeah, look at that. You have support. There you go. Ooh. Thank you, my friend. I'll never forget what you did. Anytime you need music from me, I'll be happy to help. Oh wow, there we go, four out of five. This medallion represents self-confidence. This means you have helped someone in need and learned the great virtue of believing in yourself. Yeah, that's so fun. Okay, let me kidnap all you guys. It was fun and all, but see you later. And you are actually gonna stay out and this I'm gonna keep because there is somewhere where it needs to rain. Um. Let me put my medallions down. So now we have four. Let me get this other one out here. Nice. Alright, so put that one there. And then, hey, I brought the party bag! The party's bag! And we're actually gonna switch around things! Everyone's gonna talk in different spots now! 
All right. Music, good. Here, now we can make it rain here. Oh, I forgot one more guy. There you go. Okay. Let's see. Let's get... Oh, nope. Let's put you... Oh! It's another one of you! So I need one more of them. There we go. And then I still need to catch four fishies for you. And this has a music spot. What do you do? <gasps> ah! And that is the fourth and last one that we need for... The lady! Cool. Alright, so now we just need to go wake up the hippo, put the four babies away. And I think that's all we know about right now. We still have to find the witch. Which you have yet to find. Mm, wait, is it, is it up here? No. It's up here. Yep, 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 yep. Alright, here's one sister. Thank you! Here's two sister. Thank you. Uh, I need to put my tent down. I need to grab the other two. All right, fun time's over. You will. Li I'm literally kidnapping you right when I get back. <laughs> right when I put you guys down, you guys are going back in my backpack and back into the tent. Just doing this because one bigger one asked. Thank you, and this one looks just like you. How beautiful my little sisters are. Thank you for bringing them back to me. As a token of gratitude, I will enhance your magic by making that sticker book a bit bigger. I hope you enjoy it. I still need four more sisters with me. Would you help me bring them? Oh, that's a lot bigger. Four more? I wasn't expecting four more. I don't even think we've seen that many. Hmm. Not many, like, options, at least. So, like, what's going on up there? Just a tower? Okay. Alright, hippo. Time to scoot your boot. Yeah, that's right. Get moving. <gasps> I can have the hippo in my inventory. Yes, you are going to be my friend. The desert. And a bone. Okay. Oh, are you water, please? Oh, you need water. Oh, I'll be right back. I'll be right back. How does swamp water do? I hope that's fine. How's, how's that swamp water? Yeah? Thank you. Sweet. You're one of the monks. Wisdom, strength, and power. This is the way. Yep. You're coming with me. All right, what's it say? Hello, my child. If you made it this far, it's because you've helped people, the people from here. I'm proud of you. We will see each other soon. My friend the cow needs to complete her fish collection. Could you help her? When you get the five medallions, you can place them on their pedestals to the south of here. Love you, Dada. Oh, Dada. Oh. Oh, he's just leaving, so he went on a trip. Okay, we'll find you, Papa. Oh. Ooh, we need to water that. Dang it, I should have gotten some water. And- Oh, <gasps> this otter is so cool. This otter is so cool. Hey, wait, I'm trying to catch something important. I want to help my friend the cow with her collection. Here, a special kind of fish. They say there's a special way to make it appear. I think it likes music explosions in the night. You could try any method. Uh, you're going in here. Music, night, an explosion! Yeah, you you better appear. It's already been out, actually. Yeah! That's it. Five, five. All right, let's put everything back. Everyone, I didn't even put the music out. I just realized it's just standing there frozen. All right, all right, all right, all right. Sweet. Okay. And then anything else up here? 
Oh, the cat! That's right, I need to go get the dog! Ooh, are you the witch? Hello! Young lad, I no longer have any candy, please leave. You're not leaving. It's always night here and there's nothing to do. In fact, I'm bored with the perpetual night. I wish it could be daytime for at least one day. Boy, do I have the solution for you. Ta-da! Oh, daylight! It's been such a long time since I've seen daylight, and it brings me joy. Alright, I'll give you the most delicious candy in the world. Something that the raccoon has been asking me a lot. Oh, Sweet. Thank you. Do you want anything else? I already have all the ingredients for the ritual that will free me completely. I only need a presence of a soul and an eclipse to cast the spell. Bring a ghost during an eclipse and I'll achieve my task. Mwahaha! Alright, I know how to get the eclipse going, but I think I need the cat for the soul? Maybe? Hmm, I don't know. Oh, hello! Welcome to these warm lands. Long ago, there was rain here that helped us for a long time. It may sound strange, but we need rain here. Yeah, I got you. Don't worry. There you go. This has been a miracle. Nah, it was just a sticker book. Uh, I won't need this shovel anymore. You can keep it. Oh, thanks. What is this for? You can use it to dig the spots where you see a crack. Use it, uh, use it there and show me what you find. Okay. Uh, a boinky, a spoinky. Oh, okay. There's a bone. Just like that. Use the shovel on all the spots that look like that. Sweet! And I'm kidnapping you. We're getting full of people. Full of new people. Come on. You too. And... Oh, my ring. Can go... There we go. Alright. Oh, we're back here. Okay. So, we need to go get the dog. And put the dog somewhere that I totally forgot. But it was like a cat was asking for a dog. I'm not gonna remember properly. And what is this nighttime thing? I don't get it. Something with those sparkles, but... I don't think we're there yet, to be honest. Hmm. Maybe we just need to wait a little longer. Alright, I got your last uh, fishy. Here you go. You've done a great job. <gasps> the last piece! Sweet. The medallion represents persever perseverance. This means you have helped someone in need and learned the great virtue of work hard to reach your goals. Heck yeah, I did. And that's five out of five medals. And you're coming with me. Alright. So, I need to find where that cat thing was. You know what? The map will tell me. But I don't think it will tell me, like, in specific. Huh. I need to get that cat. I remember it was, like, around here. And then I went down. I haven't even been there yet. Yeah, I haven't found my way to get to that spot. Let's see. Oh, you know what? That the guy. Wait, hold on, hold on, hold on. Just thinking about it. The thing that was round for the water slide, that wasn't a squirrel. That well, that's a bird. That wasn't a squirrel. That was the um the raft. Oh, there's dig spots. Hold on, I'm passing up all these dig spots. Am I? Did I pass up a dig spot? Not there. Okay, so I just passed up this dig spot. Is this where a fairy's gonna be? <laughs> yeah. You're coming with me. I need to find four more of you guys. That's gonna be freaking wild. I'm just gonna have to scan everywhere. It's a bit tedious, but you know. We must do what we must do. Yeah, he belongs here. Okay, I need to put my... Need my tent in an open area. There we go. All right, let's bring the party here. Uh, candy for you, by the way. Is that a witch's lollipop? How did you get it? Give it to me. Yum yum. Oh, we have to walk all the way back for your statue. <laughs> if you want to play some sticker tennis, let's go to the court. Do I have to play sticker tennis with you? Uh, guys, I have a manatee. Maybe Nancy, you can like hang out with Crab. Yeah, y'all just hang out. 
And then I got another girly for you. Hey, potato! All right, so that's the girl's corner. It's a very tight corner. <laughs> and then let's get the other monk over here. Yep, do your, do your monk things. Get this girl here, him, there. Sweet, I don't know what I gotta do with bones. So I'm just gonna put the bones here, but I know I need him. All right. And I think that's all I have to deal with, right? Don't need any, I don't need any of them. Do I need to take out anyone else? No. But I do need to go get the, um, that raccoon statue. Here you go, buddy. Ready for the trip? Are we going together? Kidnap- oh. Oh, you have to be here to be unlocked. Oh, I'm just not seeing you again. Oh. Woo! Did I fall? Oh my gosh! <gasps> I was so far away! Was that even worth it? No? <laughs> oh no. Let me go get that raccoon statue. Well, I'm at least near here. Gosh dang it. I have to walk all the way back now. My goodness. I didn't think it was just gonna launch me just to a different area that we already knew about. Okay, so we have to go up here, up here, here. Dude, they took us so far. Alright, I'm kidnapping Penguin again. There is no need <laughs> for any of that mess to happen again. Um, we're still missing that thing for that guy's ring. You! Come here! How dare you freaking launch me across the map unconsensually. Alright. You can talk to her. Everyone just chill out. Raccoon statue, you could be by your statue, because I feel like you're narcissistic. You like to steal and quote unquote be playful, which I don't really take kindly. Let me actually grab my medallions, because I have all my medallions now, and I could place it on the uh, pedestal. There we go, and there we go. Do I need anything else from this, from in here? Don't think so. Love how this room is turning out. Okay, I hate how cramped they are though. They can like, no, 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 stop. I don't need that. I just, I just want you girls. There you go. You guys look so cute. I love them. <laughs> the manatee is so freaking cute. Okay, uh, house here. And then I, I need to borrow your dog. Please don't be sad. Oh, you know what? I could take you! Oh my gosh, you can no longer be lonely. I'll just take you with me. <laughs> Alright, uh... Nope. Yeah, there we go. Take that back. Now, oh, I'll take you with me too. I forgot you existed. What? Where is it? There was like, it was somewhere, dude. Do I really need the raccoon here? What does the raccoon want to do here for? What? Okay. When you're ready, come talk to me and we'll get started. But why? I don't wanna. I don't wanna play. Let the game begin! Alright. Do we just need to play one game and you'll be happy with yourself? Can we, can we speed it up a little? Oof. Oof. What a hit. What a hit. What a hit. Here we go. Oh, are you going to be able to catch it? Oh, yeah, you are. And I'll be able to... Boom. Boom. Ooh, ooh. Yep, that's what I thought. Here we go. Is this just to see who who lasts the longest? I got it. You can't defeat this. All right. Whoa, that was some pre-planning you got there. Oh! Oh! Awesome, your score was nine. Take this! Why did you give me trash? Wait, I don't want to play with you. I want to kidnap you. You're going back in my inventory. I'm tired of you. 
I don't need this. Give me trash. What is this? Why'd you give me trash, man? Alright, let's put him back. You and your trashy ways. Yeah, I'm not playing with you. And then he could- I don't know, I kind of like him here. He could be there, and you could be with the dog until like figure it out. Oh, he moved. Willingly. That was odd. They have not really walked on their own volition. Um, hey guys, meet her. Oh, they do interact, I love that. Okay, y'all actually go near the dog. That's so weird. Can you lose in this game? Like, die? I don't think so. I think this game is very, like, peaceful. Very, very peaceful. Now, where is that medallion stand? Mm. There's also something else that we had to water, right? I think it was in the desert. That we had to water. I'll check there real quick. Yep, there it is. Is that for another fairy? Yep. <laughs> Alright, so we're two for two two for four. Um, so we need to find Oh, there's another digging spot. Is there gonna be another one here? Oh, that's the tooth! That's the tooth that we need for the cave. Fun! Okay, now is there anything up here? Gosh, it's so bright. Oh yeah, the cat. Gosh, we need to find that cat. Maybe I should take a look at that map. Maybe the map will actually tell me where it is. But let's put the medallions out first. Here we go. Alright, balloon in the middle. Heart in the thing. Ba da ding ding. Ba da da ding. And ba da da ding. Whoa! Rainbow! Oh, is this sad? Is Papa okay? I am immensely glad that you have made it this far. That only means one thing. You are ready. If you are here, it's because you managed to help and learn five great virtues. I wish I could have advised you and shown you these valuable lessons myself. Carry those medallions with you always and apply those learnings throughout your life. Always be a good person, have good friends, take care of yourself, always trust yourself, strive to achieve your goals, and above all, enjoy every moment of life. I'm sure that with these teachings you are now a person who can move forward on your own. You know I will always be with you. With love, always, your dad. Oh, oh all the friends that we kidnapped! Hey! Did all these guys know him? I guess so. Your father planned all this for you in case you couldn't find him. He always knew you would succeed. Remember when I met- I remember when I met your father. He was always talking about and how both of you enjoyed collecting stickers. Intruder, I learned from your father the power of stickers. Undoubtedly, we will always miss him. Reaching this point is a great achievement. Your father will always be with you. You will always have the love and support of all the inhabitants of this island. Aww. Oh, Papa! Papa, this breaks my heart! Is that the end of the storyline? <gasps> Cutscene! Oh, that's our daddy. We played catch with him. really good story we're gonna keep playing and um and get that last quest done I don't know what the re maybe maybe we shouldn't actually I was thinking about it I don't know like I kind of want to but then again I think it, this is like a really great point to end it because that was this was the meaning of it this was the whole meaning of like the reason why this story happened and why we played it that was so good that was so heartwarming and wholesome oh I love that 
That was so sweet. Oh, Papa. We saw all those memories of our daddy. We didn't know he was gone. I figured that he was gone. But man. That was such a good game. That was such a good game. I'm so happy that we played that. Wow. Super, super, super fun. Maybe, um, maybe in a different stream I'll definitely, um, finish up this. And, uh, yeah, like, finish up the rest of the stuff that we're missing. I think that would be fun to do in a different stream. But this was a great way to end, uh, this game. Wow, and that was super fun. It's super creative. And I love the whole solving puzzles. Of course, I'm not a fan of running back and forth. <laughs> but this was really, really fun. And, um, yeah, we still definitely have stuff to do on it. So I'll definitely play that next time. Oh, are those all that we're missing? What is that? Those must be the stuff that we're missing, maybe. <sighs> Man. What a beautiful story. Can we take them back? No, they didn't. He said I could carry the medals. He lied. All right. So that I will leave there. And then we'll definitely um, play that in a different time. So let's see. Yeah, because there's so much that we can still do. Take all the lost fairies home. Brotherhood pay praise to the dark goddess. Reunite the lost brothers. Hey, that's what I'm doing right now. Help the witch in her ritual. Watch a rainbow in the sky. Win sticker tennis. Oh, I could win. Yeah, that will be fun to do. Um, and it's a plushie. Is this going to be on makeshift? If it's on makeshift, I'm going to be angry. I'm not a fan of makeshift. It is going to be on makeshift. Gosh dang it. <laughs> I'm not a fan of makeshift. Okay, so what's another thing that we can work on that we haven't worked on in a little bit? Uh, we haven't worked on witch wood in a hot minute. Maybe we'll do a little bit of witch wood. Another chapter of witch wood be, would be fun. We can also try Animal Shelter Simulator 2. Actually, let's do that. We'll try some Animal Shelter Simulator 2. Um, this is the play test. So, this will be fun. Uh, I don't think we have this going now. Hopefully it runs well. Hopefully. I doubt it, though. Please don't crash my game. Please don't, please don't crash my computer. I don't need this. But yeah, apparently Animal Shelter Simulator 2 is going to have multiplayer. And me and my friends are really, really excited for that. So that will be really fun. Um, what's another thing that we can do? Um, yeah, we could do... Not for broadcast, we still have to finish that. Um, I'm trying to think of other stuff that isn't like scary based that we have. I have them all here. Is my... my I'm just hoping I'm still streaming. It looks like I'm still streaming, but it looks like the game... There it is! Okay, wait, oh, did I click out of it? I hear it! You are it? Alright, nice. You are playing the playtest version of the game. The game is still under development, and its contents are subject to change. If you have any feedback, make sure to fill out our survey after you finish playing. Remember the wishlist game? Yep. Definitely. Playtest, yeah. Okay, so this will be fun. Dishonored, Fierce to Fathom, episode four. I want to, I want to, but t this stream is gonna be like not scary for now. Um, but a survey I'll definitely fill out after we do this. So shelter, can we rename it? Can I? Oh, I could. Uh, we'll put Nene's shelter. Nene shelter. Nene's, Nene nest. Nene nest. It's my nest. Here we go. This is so good. Oh yeah, Fears to Fathom episode 4 is coming out soon, right? I'm excited. I haven't heard nothing about it. And I haven't been watching like a lot of like video game YouTubers anymore. So and or streamers. Like I've even cut off the streamers, but like now I'm like I'm excited. I'm ready. Oh, here we go. Good gosh, those animals look terrifying. <laughs> the cat looks terrifying. Uh, you played it already, silly. Oh, that's how I found your channel. The fourth one? Hold on. There's... What is it? It's Home Alone, Norwood Hitchhike, 
Iron Park Lookout, and then Carson House. I haven't played Carson House. Right? The Watchtower. Yeah, Normal Hitchhiker. Is that four? Oh my gosh. But I know another one's coming out. Uh, oh my gosh, it might be four. I heard someone told me that it's gonna come out. Carson is three. Oh. The fourth one was so good. But I heard that they're coming out with their fifth one at some point. Someone said it to me in my comments that the fifth one's coming out in March or in April. The animals are in need of a new home. You bought an abandoned warehouse with one goal in mind. Turn it into an animal shelter that will rehome as many animals in need as possible. Renovate the facility and help lonely, abandoned, and sick animals find health, happiness, and a loving home. And apparently put them on ketamine. All right. Ooh, the game's running fine. Looks like it's running fine on my stream. Typical simulator. All right. Uh. What do I gotta do? Oh, was Oh, is this trash? No more! <laughs> is that trash? No longer! Oh, if cleaning was just this easy. That would make my life so much easier. Dang, man. Freaking bought this dump, me? Oh, the view is so much better. Dude, we are surrounded by mountains. I only know one place that's like that, and it's fun. That looks cool. Sweet. All right, let's clean up all this trash. This is not suitable for animals. Look at that. That AC's hanging off by a freaking thread. This place looks nice so far. Graphics look better, or whatever assets they're using look better. Holy cow, we have so much space. Okay, here's our... My goodness! What on earth? Why so much trash? Is this reception? Oh my gosh. Why is that? <laughs> Work in progress? Warning. Alright, alright. What was that? Is that like a staff room? Oh yeah, in like uh, Animal Shelter uh, 2, they said that, um... Feels like, is the game too loud? I hope not. It said that, um... What do you say? That you're gonna hire people? That will be fun. Because hiring people is something that people have always been asking about. Also, very cute clock. I love that. Love the decor. Let's look at the animals. <laughs> it's just the whole thing on the head. Like, look at that. That's... Oh, that's so cute. Those two together. That's adorable. This is so cute. This is going to be so cute. I love it. I love it. I love it. I love it. All right, let's keep cleaning this up. It's a freaking pigsty. No birds? Well, we don't know just yet. Literally, their trailer. I remember the trailer for Animal Shelter Simulator 1. They added a freaking alligator in it that you could, like, have a shelter for an alligator. <laughs> and that never happened. And here they are making a second game. Oh. It looks nice, though. Like, that photo is so freaking cute. Oh, I love that. And that photo is so terrifying. Okay. Um, cute, clean, cute, clean. Oh. <laughs> Dental. <laughs> That's freaking crazy. Cute shampoo. There's some good photos at least. Hair. That's cute. Oh, look at that! <laughs> Adorable. Okay. Clean up the garage. Why do we have a garage? We never drove before. Are we driving now? Oh. Well, that's clean. Uh, garage! Wait, hold on. Are we actually picking up animals from like a location? There we go. Uh, clean up the cat cages. Is this cat cages or is this just more storage? It's looking like it's more storage. Okay. Uh, is this cat cages? This is cat cages. Oh, more? Oh my gosh. Dude, this better have been a cheap buy because all this labor to clean this up ain't no way. All right, all right, all right. Very nice. Very nice. Whoa! All right, we got a roof. Okay, where's dog cages? Is this leading to the dogs? No, it's just more garbage. All right, where's the dog cages? Oh, I can't leave that way. My bad, my bad, my bad. Cat cages look nice, though. Nice area for them to roam free. 
All right, dog cages are, of course, on the other side. You don't want the dogs and the cats to mix together. That will start a fight. Yes, never mix species. All right, that's storage, I guess, for the dog stuff. And then here we go. Even in, like, the first uh, simulator, they even simulated dog fights, but that never happened in the game either. Which, honestly, I think is fine. Um, open the tablet. That there we go. Whoa! Hey, look, there's your bird. <laughs> there's your bird potato. Animals in shelter. Oh, that's so sad. Manage shelter. So we got reception, washing station, storage, office, vet, social room, dog isolation, isolation, cat isolation, garage, dog kennels. Okay, so we need workers. There, they're the workers. Uh. Add a cage? What? Add a door? What? I'm confused. Why? What? How does that work? What? What did I do? Oh! Well, looky here. Oh, look at that. They have like a kennel to go inside? That's really cool! I see! So this is just like showing the lineup of what it looks like. So like cage, then cage, cage, and then like I can have a door. Like that? Yeah! That looks good. I like that a lot. Yeah! Oh, so cool! Uh, let's do that on the cat side too. Cat kennels. Cage, cage, door, cage, cage. That's so cool! Wait, hold on. How's my camera doing? Oh, am I? Is this is this breaking my game? Is this breaking my camera? Maybe I should lower the graphics. Uh, we'll put it on medium. Oh boy. Uh, okay, let me see. Wait, is my camera- my camera looks fine now. Is it fine now? It looks fine now. Alright. Uh, select a pet to take in through the map. Let's take in a kitty. Frugo, the animal was found walking up and down the highway. Oh, <laughs> clearly very stressed out by the loud noise of the cars. It had a collar with no tag, no chip. Send a car. Oh, and that's our garage car. So is he gone? Yep, there he goes. Bye! I didn't even know you were in there. Safe driving! Hope you can find him. Bye! No, oh, alright. You didn't have to close it on me. Okay, clean up the outdoors. I thought I did. Remember, uh, clean the whole shelter, even the yard. How do I get back here? Oh. There we go. Whoa, 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 whoa! Oh, it's nice and repaired. Oh, you're fixing the drains and the gutters. Nice. And the AC. We have AC. Uh, take the animal from the van. Place the animal inside inside the bot cage. Okay. And this is the dog side, right? Very hard to tell. So let's mess around. Shop. Basic cat food. Medicine hygiene. So the medicine is going to come in. I can't contact anyone. And then camera. Cool, they're tying the camera in together with the tablet. Which is really nice because the tablet and all this was like in one spot and you had to go back and forth, back and forth. But this is really, really good. So how long does it- can I look on the map to see? See there? Is this the active pickup? You got Cyan University. Oh! Hello? <gasps> Hi! Is there a demon in there? Hello? Whoa! <gasps> oh my gosh. Aww, it's so dirty. Wait, no, I want to clean him. Where's the bot? Where do I... Isn't this the cat quarantine? Maybe we don't have quarantine yet. Hey! Maybe I should space out the cages? Oh, it's happy. Okay, let's let's just put her down. 
The animal will came. Okay. Yeah. It's yours. Oh, she looks so messed up. Can I pet you? Get pet's attention? Hey! Are you okay? Oh, the body looks a lot better than the first one, too. You alright? Man, you're happy. It's good to know that you're happy! <laughs> Look at that smile! Look at you! You're so happy! You like belly rubs? Oh, you like belly rubs. Oh, you're so cute. Alright. Alright, you're fine! Alright, open, buy food, food bowl, water, water bowl. Okay. Uh, food, basic cat food, bowl, water, water bowl. Cart, purchase, and I'm assuming this is going to come in via drone. Yep, there it is. There you are. Hey, can I have that? Thank you. Sweet. So let's put the bowl down. Ew, it looks like worms. Are they supposed to be sausages? Hello, little thing! <laughs> You're so cute. You're way cuter than the first games. Um, Alright, I'll put your bowl here. And then I'll put your water... See, like, I know that, like, cat... Like, apparently... Yeah, I'll put your water up here. Ooh, that would be nice. So, like, for cats, I saw that, like, you're supposed to put the water, uh, not near the food. Because apparently, like, they'll deem the water as dirty water. Oh. You know, that counts! Whoa, 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 whoa! Escape me! Whoa, 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 whoa! Close the doors, close the doors! Hey, 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 yo! Yo! Whoa. <laughs> well, don't look at me like that, okay? Alright, um, let's chill out. I understand now. You definitely need to be, like, you, you need, we need doors closed. It actually matters in this game. Gosh, don't do that. Don't break your back on me. Okay, so we need to increase your fun. Uh, can I... Gosh, stop breaking your back. You need to eat. I need to fill your food. There you go. Eat up, little champ. Please don't look at me. <laughs> oh, oh. Oh. Alright. There you go. There you go, you little baby, huh? Scoliosis. Alright, you're good. We have to increase that fun. There you go. Alright, go to sleep. Alright, bye! My gosh. You're like a worm. It's like the back of your body not working, and so you have to use the front of your body in order to work. Like, oh my gosh. Alright, go to sleep. Go to the front gate to leave the shelter for the night. Bye! Little demon? It is a demon, dude. Alright, sweet. Uh, so, up here. Alright, good night! Going to sleep is new. Sleep is not available during the day. Did I ask to sleep? No. Nay, nay's nest. Um, isn't this supposed to go by the trash? Well, uh, put it back here. This will be our trash spot. Uh, fill the bowl, fill the water, buy a laser plate with the pet. Alright, let's buy a laser now, actually. Music is so good. Leash. Alright, we have no hygiene or medicine stuff, which is course okay can I open it now I can <laughs> all right and uh, let's uh no oh, that box stay there okay oh kitty close the front door close any exit that this cat can go through because this cat is fast kitty kitty hello little thing how you doing all right I'm just gonna Oh, did you escape? You tried it, you little scamperoony. It's all right. Got you water. Mineral water. And then I got you food. Oh, nope. Didn't mean to do that. You can't open it. There you go. You ready to, to play? Look. Laser. Ah, you like it. There you go. This is not enough space. Can I take you outside? Let's, let's go outside. Or maybe I could just put, leave you out here. Huh? Oh, thank you for the follow! Cool, we reached the goal. Sweet. Thanks so much for the follow. Uh, are you gonna play with me? Hey, there, there you go. <laughs> Needed a little break. Oh, the door's open. Wait, 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 wait. 
All right, now we're safe. <laughs> no door open. Hey, look at that. All right, so you're maxed out. So now I get to take a photo of you. Oh, man. Yeah, let's take a photo of you. <laughs> you Just like that. All right, say cheese. Adorable. And now we can use this for the adoption. <laughs> the freaking picture. Reach 50? Oh, this is all new. Post. Oh, and it costs money to post an ad. No worries. I literally just got recommended to you on YouTube. Kind of been hanging a little. I want to give you a follow. Oh, thank you, Fims. Much appreciated, man. Um, Can I... I have to schedule a visit? Oh, man. Who should we pick? Barry, Alex, or Ethan? I'm, I'm marking out Alex. So, Barry or Ethan? Oh, we got another one. Dominic. Ooh. I'm thinking Barry might be a might be a good one. Let's do, let's do Bear Bear. Uh, wait, how do I schedule? As soon as possible. Visit in progress. Okay, are you here? Go back in your thing. We don't we don't want to scare him. Yeah, stay there. Uh, Barry. Oh, I need to buy a leash. Oopsies. Uh, I like the emo. <laughs> Yeah, they're actually sick emus. They look really good. Uh, more. Bye. Let's see. Purchase. There we go. Welcome to the potential adopter. Oh, do I have to go to reception? I'm coming! Oh, no one's here. Let them get to know each other. Show the adopter the- Hello? <gasps> you slept my goodness you can go to sleep we could go see each other tomorrow at least get some eight hours my guy hello adopter NPC is busy oh <laughs> you know what that's valid that's valid all right uh, oh are you following me oh you are okay hey all right yeah cuz you know I own this place of course you wouldn't know where to go and you know I have to take you to the cat right all right um the cats in here Mind you, it has a very loose back. You know, it does a lot of... Does a lot of that. You know what I'm saying? So, like, don't be scared. Okay? Um, here he is! Yeah! Does this... How... Do I have to, like... Frugo! Frugo, come out! Frugo! Yeah, there's your animal! <laughs> have fun! <laughs> have fun with the animal! <laughs> you like him? Is he good for you? No, don't open the door! What are you doing? The, he can get out! What are you doing? Close the door! Do you not- What are you doing? You're sabotaging this shelter! This is not how you do it! Why do you want him to roam free? I'm picking up the cat. Come here, Frugo. What is wrong with you? Wait, sir- Whoa, whoa, sir. Whoa! Uh... Sir, this is very unprofessional. Um, can you please just, just, just step off? All right. Why do you want to go? Do you want to go outside? Is this the thing? Why do you keep opening the door? Give the animal, oh, give the animal to the adopter. Oh, this is for you. Use leash on animal and pass it to the visitor. Oh, oh, so it's my fault. All right. Sorry. Sorry, Frugo. Can you just... Okay, you know what? I'll just go. I'll be right back. Dude, is this that? Is this haunted? Um, hi, Tetris. Tetris world record got beat twice today by the same person. It doubled. That's insane, Tyler. It doubling is crazy. All right, I got the leash. Sixteen million. Oh, it's over. Uh, it's over. Who's gonna get that? Watch him double it to 32 million by tonight. I got your leash. Where's the cat? Uh, sir? Where did you last see him? <gasps> the freaking door is open. 
Oh no. Oh, both of them were open. Oh no. Frugo? Frugo! I see you! I see you! Get, get over here! Get over here! Bad kitty! Get, 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 get in here! Bad kitty! Wait, where's my freaking. Where's my leash? Where did my leash go? Frugo, can you just stay? Bring your pack. Don't move. There's my leash. Okay, alright. No! Frugo, don't you run away. Don't you. Fr Frugo! Frugo! Fr Frugo! What is my leash doing? Fr Frugo, get. What are you doing? Uh, 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 what's the button? What's the button? Oh my gosh. Alright! We got it! We got it. Don't worry. It's under control. Alright, you want this demon cat? Take him. It's fine. Just take him. Get him out of my sight. Alright, here you go. Frugo? Get, get over here. Here you go. I have to buy those leashes too? Oh gosh, oh gosh. Please be gentle with him. Please, why? You're just... Success! <laughs> it's a success! State of the pet's needs. Pet's preparation state. Shelter state during visitation. 6%! The animals have found a home. Okay, let's play one more time, but let's do the dog. I want to see what the dog looks like. Wait, does that mean I have to clean up everything? Does that mean I have to clean up everything? I don't want to do that. I just want... Oh no! No! Okay. No. Take me to main menu. I'm gonna take the survey. Right now. We're about to answer these serious questions. Alright, yes. Thank you. Give me this survey. Alright, here we go. Uh, okay, I got there all right, never mind. Uh you know. Uh let me just can I just like not show my email? That'd be great. Thank you. Alright. Uh cats, dogs, both. Both, I think is a viable answer here. Um let's see. How much did you enjoy playing the game? I'll give it a solid seven. Did the game run smoothly? I would say so. Not as smooth as it can make it. Uh, if not, please provide your specs. How did you rate the missions and tasks? They were very fun and explained everything. They weren't fun. I think they're fun. I find like if, I find this type of game fun. What if would you like to see uh, improved in the missions tasks? Not much. How did you like the animals? <laughs> oh well. Uh. You know, I'll give it a solid 8. Uh, what would you say? Uh, better physics, right? Better physics? Right? I mean, I don't know how else you would say the cat thing. How did you like the interactions? Picking up, using them, placing, interacting. Uh, I'm gonna give that a lower one. What would you like to, uh, change the drop button? Yeah, the drop button to me needs to be changed. Uh, how did you like the character movement? There was jumping in the game? Movement was fine. Nothing nothing different to that. Uh, if anything, would you like to see character movement? How did you rate the non-player characters? <laughs> they scared me! Uh, add an icon- I think it's like add an icon above their head. Uh, I don't know, I mean... I think just adding an- mm, I don't know. Maybe, like, notify where they are. Where the NPCs are. I think that's the best option. Overall, graphic graphs are great. Um, is there anything you didn't like about the gameplay? Not really. It's like one two. It's like 128 information. I got a meeting eight hours. Keep streaming. Hope I catch you again. What I want to about this place. Aw, oh, thank you, Fims! Ha uh, have a good meeting, I guess. <laughs> have a good night. What if, if anything caused the biggest issues, was the hardest to understand? Leashing a running pet. Jeez. Running pet. Did you find a bug that blocked your game pay gameplay? No. Oh, good. Docs, great. Is there anything else you'd like to share with us? Uh, birds! Got you. I got you, potato. Birds. Sweet. Alright. That was, uh, Animal Shelter Sim. Sweet. That was fun. Let's see... Um, really excited to see how that comes out.
because I do want to play with my friends with that. We're gonna, I'm just gonna move that to somewhere else. Manage, remove from projects. Okay, so let's see what else we got here. We can do, not for broadcasts, we'll probably do that um, hour three. Let's do some Witchwood. We haven't done Witchwood in a while. And Witchwood is really fun, so we'll do some of that. I also saw the Supermarket Simulator is freaking popping off right now. Should I ever do that? I want to take a look at it. Oh, my freaking knee. Let's see. Can I take a look at it? Is it going to allow me? Well, it's probably loading the game first. But that was fun. That was enjoyable. I really do hope they add a variety of animals. Because their game developers have have made other animals before like the devs have a pet hotel simulator and they have that for fish bunnies turtles and cats and dogs so like they have the ability to do different animals so i would love to see that um when it comes to like other animals like birds and even in their trailers alligators let's see okay supermarket simulator is something that's been going off lately. It's got great reviews. I should probably try this. Maybe I'll try this Thursday. That seems like fun. Yeah, we'll try that Thursday. But, let's get into Witchwood. Well, we did chapter one, and we got one piece of the puzzle down. Forgot how many chapters there are. Good morning! I kind of forgot how to play, but we'll figure it out. Um, okay. Do I need to just go outside? Hello? Oh, good morning! I trust you've made up your mind. Will you collect the souls I've asked for? Or would you prefer to stay stuck in this festering swamp? Alright, alright. No need to get your horns in a twist. I'll do as you ask. You haven't given me much choice. Splendid! As it happens, I can already sense the first four souls we seek. Two are in the forest, another in the swamp to the north, and the last in the fields to the south. Could you be more specific? Near a shapely stump? Perhaps inside a tree with a face? By an overgrown mushroom grove? What do I look like? A compass? Go out there and look for yourself. Alright, new chapter. Yep, this is what we were doing last. The Sleeping Maiden. Tab to view. Uh, journal. Okay, so let's do... I guess we're just doing them, right? Collect the four souls for the goat. Uh, we'll see how long it takes to collect one soul, and we'll see. But maybe let's do bear in the forest. I mean, that's just easily right there. So, which one's the forest? I need to lower this game a little bit. Also, peep the <laughs> peep the wallpaper <laughs> my friend made. Uh, forest. For we literally have no portal anywhere else. Okay. What do we got going? In the forest, right? Where would this bear... Ah, oh, there we go. Bear's right there. Ooh, that's so loud for me. I, I, I want to make sure the volume's good for everyone else here. But I also don't want to go deaf. Okay. Uh, delayed shipment from the fields angers the bear even further. I guess. <laughs> Yeah, that's basically what the wallpaper is. That's where we can only use mugs. Alright, where is this bear? Yes, that's the crying guy. Here we go. Man, he looks in distress. He's freaking green. Oh, hello there! Sorry, I managed to get most of the d debris off the road. Looks like you've made a fine wreck. What on earth happened to your cart? Yes, well... See, I was sent on a very important mission by order of my captain. The bear. The bear, you say? Sort of mission. Uh, my, it's my job to make sure the Lakeshore camp is well stocked with provisions, but most importantly, a steady supply of honey for the bear's favorite mead. I was just on my way back from the apiary with a, care, with a cart full when a deer or something darted out of nowhere. Jostled my poor mule so bad that she broke her, br her bridle? and ran off. My own heart nearly leapt out of my ribcage. Piled the darn cart right into the ditch she did. Now every barrel is smashed 
and I can't bring myself to report back empty-handed, the bear will have my g guts for garters! I'm sure of it! This bear sounds like quite a brute. Oh, you don't know half of it! If he doesn't get his honey meat, he heads will roll! Maybe you can lend me a hand? I can't very well put this broken cart back together. No, no, nothing like that. But could you take a message to the sergeant of Lakeshore Camp? He's a reasonable fellow. Let him know what happened. And maybe he can get me out of this bind. <laughs> you can get to the Lakeshore Camp if you follow the road to the northwest west of here. I need to stay with the cart and ass <laughs> assess the- I thought it said asses. Assess the damages. <laughs> oh, da dear. Da -da 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 Press tab to open your journal review. Quest objectives. Track quest to display what to do next. Uh, there we go. New chapter. The bear. Okay, so each one is a chapter. Okay, fair enough. Easy enough. Uh, oh yeah, he's nervous. So we're gonna track the bear for today. Uh, there we go. Find the sergeant of Lakeshore Camp. He said northwest, right? And that's the snake. Uh, northwest of here. Oh, all the way up there. Way, way, way west. I don't know why I was looking more freaking east. Is there a run? Can I run? Actually, this map is kind of small. I don't really need to run. Uh, this way? Hello? Anyone here? Whoa, what the frick are you? Oh, I almost knocked over my cup. Uh, a goblin? What? Talks big, but is cowardly at heart. What are you doing here? How can I capture you? A dreadful doll. Ah, oh, you're mean! Okay, I'm sorry. Is this the way? No, this is to the swamp. I don't need to go to the swamp. Uh, so maybe I just need to go more west? Hello? Is this the right way? It is! Thanks for a Oh, it is! Hello! <laughs> Dingus. Hey! Where do you think you're going? Yeah, no one but us soldiers are allowed inside the lakeshore camp. Get out of my way. I have urgent news of your quartermaster. I need to speak with your urgent so with your sergeant. Uh, urgent? Only thing that's urgent is the line for the latrine, or if the captain hasn't had his drink. That's right. Captain Bear is in a right foul mood. You can't come in unless you want a good thrashing. The guard almost has to shout over the clattering, clattering din coming from inside the camp. You heard him. It's dangerous in there. You wouldn't have the heart to let a frail old granny like you near that beast. One guard turns to the other with a conspiration conspiratorial shrug conspiratorial yep yeah, who are we to say what's good for her health oh yeah you're right we might be convinced to uh look the other way if we was fairly compensated right fairly compensated of course we'd be sticking our necks out after all money you want money Guards hold out their hands expectantly like children begging for game. money, please. Like that meme. Money, please. Fine, take it. You carefully press three heavy gold coins into the palm of the waiting guard. There. I expect you two can divide them evenly amongst yourselves. Right. One for you, two for me. What? You mean two for me and one for you? I'm the one who does all the real guarding around here. You still owe me for that game of dice you lost. You cheated me! Give me them coins! The two guards fall into fist cuffs, fist to cuffs and roll into the bushes, leaving the gate to the camp wide open. Well, good job, Dingus and Dongus! Uh, wow, everyone's kind of passed out here. I'll take that. Goody, goody, gumdrops for me. Is that the bear? Oh my god! <laughs> Dude! As you cautiously approach, the bear drains the last of his enormous tankard and smashes it against the head of a nearby soldier, knocking the hapless man to the ground. And then I wallop them, just like that. So next time I catch any of you cowards turning tail, I'll skewer you like a fish and leave your guts for the gulls. 
Suddenly noticing that his drink has gone dry, the bear bellows to the sky. More me, you yellow belly worms! More drink! Bring me my delicious honey mead! The soldiers taking cover nearby exchange nervous glances at each other, none want wanting to confront the bear. There's no more honey mead! The bear wipes a strand of drool, of drool from his sagging lip, and be his bleary eyes slowly focus on you. A mocking smirk splits his face as he waves at you with his great spiked maze. Say, now that's a funny looking helmet, soldier. I ever tell you the time I crushed the bucket-headed barbarians of the western mountains? You decided that now is a good time to leave the bear to his ramblings, rather than make yourself an unfortunate prop in his war stories. The bear kicks an empty tankard at you as you retreat back into the camp. That's right! Go get me more mead, you good-for-nothing slaggard! Wow! <laughs> You're great, dude! You're hilarious! Alright, alright, I get it, I get it. Calm down, calm down, I get it. Alright, alright, calm down! Dude, he is like a baby. <laughs> He's like a little kid! Um, that's a pig. Uh, okay, where is the captain? Are you the captain? You are, or sergeant. The frenetic looking officer shouts hurried orders at whoever will listen, but most of the camp soldiers are busy cowering or knocked out cold. Man the gates! You over there, secure the perimeter. We need to just hold out a little longer. Sir, we're running out of men. Where's that damn shipment of honey? You step over an unconscious footman to address the man in charge. I might be able to answer that question. Who the... Who, the, who let this old bat into the camp? I found your quartermaster. He's having a bit of a cart trouble on the road. I'm afraid your shipment isn't going to get here anytime soon. What? Oh, curse my rusty britches. Without that honey and other supplies, we can't make the honey mead. The bear's gonna flatten the whole camp when he finds out. The camp looks half flattened already. <laughs> What's all this ruckus about? Well, the bear is the greatest warrior there ever was. Which is grand and all when we're fighting the enemy. But once we set up camp, he likes to use us as poor sods. Wait, he likes to use poor us. Wait, he likes to use us poor sods as playthings to reenact his conquests. And the only thing the bear loves as much as fighting is drinking. Gills us up so much honey mead, we have to brew it right here in the camp just to keep up. He points to a squat looking device tucked uh, uh, near some tents a portable brewery. Without that shipment of ingredients, I don't see how we can ever calm the bear down. He'll smash us all into paste before the sun sets. Let me take a look at this brewery of yours. If the bear is so in love with brawling and boozing, then perhaps it's, a, perhaps it's about time he received a dose of his own medicine. We gonna kill a bear? Uh, where? Oh, this thing. Holy cow. You inspect the brass contraption. The tank here, hopper there. The bitter smell of alcohol is infused into the well-worn metal. Despite the needlessly complicated dials and tubing, at the end of the day, the brewery is really just a fancy cauldron. This seems simple enough. I should be able to concord the just the potion for your troubles. The rattled sergeant shrugs his shoulders at you. Sure, if you think it'll help, but you'll need to fuel that darn thing first. Our supplies are a mess, so you have to figure it out on your own. You open up the brewery to inspect its complicated innards. Oh, cool twigs. You stop kindling into the pieces and scatter it into the bottom compartments of the brewery. Should be fuel enough for the job. You open the brewery. Okay. So we need a jar of water. Five of those. Jeez. Uh, cinder box. Do we need- Now we know how to make a cinder box. How do we know how to craft? There we go. Uh, fireflies. All right, so we need to go get fireflies and make five jars of water. Uh, ooh, I'll just, I'll just take that. Don't mind me, I'm just gonna take everything. All right, you guys having a good time? It's a good time over here, yeah? All right, y'all have a good in. <laughs> what if I get close to him? <laughs> He's so angry. He's so messed up. He's like, ah. Alright, little boy. Alright, I get it. 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 Calm down. Let's get into peaceful mode, okay? Just chill out a little.
Alright, so we need to find fireflies. I don't remember the last time I saw fireflies. Maybe we'll just find them wandering about. Need some over here. Yeah, here we go. Uh, can I get that? No. How do I catch them? I forgot. There we go. There we go. I'm just gonna catch a bunch of these. Come here. No, I didn't mean to catch her. Oh well. I'll take all this. Might as well. Who's humming? Is him- is he humming? Oh, he's humming. Catch this- too. Whoa! Whoa, 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 what's that? Changeling. Those mushrooms don't do this much. <laughs> Wiggly. Uh, hatchet? How do I chop it? Uh, this ain't helping. It helped! Never mind, it helped! Okay! I just killed a child. From kidnapping to straight murder. That's how we like it. Um, so we have enough for this. Nice. And now I need to make five water, right? I think that was it. Oh, oops, ooh, ooh, made too much. That's fine. Uh, now we just need to go in the well and collect it. The well is down here, right? There it is. Right. And then... Might as well dig up this stuff while I'm here. I am using a trowel. How do I use the trowel? There we go. Oh, I have to get close. She's not really an automatic walker. Got it. Okay. And then let's dig up this part, too. Come here, you little toad! <laughs> uh, let's dig this up. I'm just gonna do some pre-collecting, just because I don't want to continuously go back and forth. If I can minimize that as much as possible, that will make my life easier. All right, let's go back. Now that we got our materials, that's all we needed, right? Yeah. yeah, on the top it says that. So we need to go just straight west. Not all the way up there, because that's for um, the swamp. Okay, cool. Gosh, I love the art style of this game. It's so like, there's so much to look at. So much to like adore. I'm back! Did you miss me? Oh, it sounds like you missed me. Glad to be here for you, Bear. Man, he's so happy that I'm here. He's cheering me on! Alright, let's see what we need for this brewery. What else do we need to do? Uh, jar of water. You slosh cool, clear water into the brewery's main tank. Not the best base for a potion brewing, but you want to preserve that honey mead flavor. You open up the brewery and cinder box. With the heat of a cinder box, you set the stove chamber of the brewery alight. It will bring the tank to a rolling boil. With a hiss of steam and the sound of boiling water, the rattling brewery is ready for the next step in the process. Of course, I'll need honey for the mead. That quartermaster said he was coming back with are coming back from the apiary in the field, so I best try there. Then I'll need a proper magical binder and a token of the bear to seal the spell. Something in this camp ought to do the trick. Frothing, the frothing basin of the brewery stands ready for the right ingredients. Honey metamorphous elixir, torn teddy bear. Well, I just got one of the metamorphous yeah. things, right? So, can I make it? I need to kill another one. And I need to get bug ichor? Iker? And then dryad fruit. Uh, captain's tent. Through the open tent flap, you catch a glimpse of a pillaged trinkets and treasures scattered around the spacious interior. You surmise that one of the precious objects might contain enough magical essence to use as a token of the bear. Your eyes have only a moment to linger upon a giant fur-lined bed before a hand pulls the door flap shut. The sergeant gives you a disapproving glare as he ushers you away. Hey, you can't go in there. This is the bear's personal tent. 
You know the kind of hell that would break loose if he finds out someone's been snooping? Don't worry, I'll be careful. Seems like your men are keeping him distracted anyways. You glance over at the bear as he tosses aside a soldier like a sack of potatoes. No way, no how. If you think this is bad, just wait until he finds out there's no more honey mead. <laughs> if you're so afraid of that stomping brute, why don't you just slip away into the night? Surely it would prolong your life a little. And abandon all my friends? We soldiers gotta stick together. It's our only chance. If only there was some way to stand up to the bear. A thought seems to cross the sergeant's mind as he notices the potions and baubles hanging about your belt. Say, you're good with magical doodads and what's-its, right? What if you made me some sort of protective charm or talisman? Then I could maybe have a chance against that monster without getting my head stoved in. You know, that could work. If I make you a protective talisman, will you let me into this tent? I suppose I wouldn't have much to worry about if you did. Okay. Protective talisman. That's- and dude, that thing is- <laughs> That thing is shamuve. It is bouncy. Alright, protective talisman. We need glue. Which we need moo. In the field. Alright, this is where we get into the game where I said that it gets crafty. We're about to get crafty in here. Um, this is where we start bouncing around places. So we need Bug Iker. Uh, I know it's in the swamp. Maybe we need to make a trap, but obviously we'll have to inspect the bugs out there first. And this, he doesn't drop anything to eat, right? Dreadful doll. No. Dryad fruit. It's another thing we need. Into the swamp. Alright, it is gloomy in here. Alright, let's inspect. That gives spirit salt baits. Oh wait, no. What is it? Oh, it doesn't tell me what it drops. It just tells me its weaknesses. That's right. Um, dragonfly. Swamp mud. Bait stick? I don't know what I need to make. Ooh, that music. That music is so familiar. And I keep hiccuping. Hi, Anna! <laughs> Welcome back, Anna. Oh, man. Okay. Um, dude, this is gonna get messy real quick. So, how do I go and get me some... I have meat. Alright, I need to find toxic tendrils. Okay. Uh, seeker vine. Oh, no! These drop the bug iker, I think. Smoke pellet loggers hatchet. I think the skeeters drop it. <laughs> I love their name too. Skeeters. Smoke bomb. Yes, I can craft that. Okay, so I need to shoot. How do I smoke? Smoke! And then hatch it! Yes! Okay. No, I don't have enough smoke! Leave me alone! Wait, is that blood that I need? Can I pick up that blood? Oh, I can. Alright, let me recoup. So, let's see. Now that I got that, do I have. Oh, what is this? Dragonfly wing. I need to kill Dragonfly. What did I get that for? Why did I kill that? I need an Iker for something, right? How could I possibly forget already? I've been lurking while I was playing. while Victor was playing a game for me. Ooh, what game was it? Metamorphous elixir. Was it the metamorphous elixir? And I'm just messing up. Yes, okay. So I need to get more bug iker, and that means I need to make more smoke bombs. Which means I need to kill more frogs. <laughs> Alright, cool. This is gonna get intense. Unless I can hit two birds with one Yes! Alright. That was easy enough. And let's get the Outlast Trials. Oh, is that new? Ooh. All right, so that should be enough. Ooh, here we go. Now we need these thistles, right? Let's see. Hi, ghost. Welcome in. Banana. Um. So, let's see. Now we got, do we have all the Iker we need? What was it for? Metamorphous Potion. We have all the Iker. Now we need Dryad Fruit and Changeling Root. And Changeling was that little mushroom baby that we killed. 
So, let's see. I'm probably just gonna go to that same spot. You're not a changeling. You're just a furry butthole. Oh, is this the dryad fruit? <gasps> Wait, what? Okay, 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 okay. What? I need to make a cinder box for you. Dang it. I need to go get rodent lard. <laughs> which means I need to make a trap. <laughs> so I need to make a trap. Which means I need to make that. Okay. Alright, so let's get the snap trap. And I need the snap trap for a squirrel, not a bird. Uh, where am I going to find me a little squirrel? I'm definitely picking up everything I see now, just so I don't have to worry about it later. Uh, squirrel. No squirrel. What is this hatchet? What, what, what is this? Oh, there's mushrooms in here. Yeah, we should get those too. Is there- Ah, oh, here's a squirrel! Here you go, squirrely! Just for you! <laughs> you didn't give me freaking lard! Oh, yeah, you did. Never mind, you're great. Now I can make a cinder box. Nope, now I need to catch more fireflies. And right there, that to that freaking mushroom its on the ground. That's the one I have to kill. Let's catch all of this, because I am not playing anymore. We are collecting 101, and you are dead. Yeah, come here. <laughs> You're mine. You're dead. Alright, uh, so now we can make a cinder box. Yep. And now we can take down that freaking tree. Come here, Mr. Tree. Where were you? I have your weakness. There you are. Ha! Oh, you don't die. You're just, you're just upset. Okay, got it. <laughs> Is it a little hot? Does it hurt just a little bit? I'll boogie with you. Very nice. All right. See ya. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. Uh, we can make this now. So that is step one diddly done. And now we need to make protective talisman. Um, which means we need wicker wood. That's it. That's a jet outside. Um... I need to go get a jar of milk, dragonfly wings, and dog hair, which means I need to make sleepy meat, which means I need to make sporific potion, which means I need to get a jar of water. <laughs> okay, we're getting there. So jar of water, easily, I have an extra jar, thankfully, and I can just go get that from the well, and then I guess I can use the guy's dog again. Yeah, because the dog's awake. Um, so I'll go get that. And then we'll go and explore the fields, because we haven't gone to the fields yet. I'll cut these two while I'm here. Yeah, free stuff. Why not? Give me all that free stuff. Yeah. Sir, you don't have to cry. You don't have to be scared anymore. I already told you. You're fine. Alright. Fill that up. Let's make a horrific potion. Okay. Dig these. Get all the clay I could possibly need right now. There we go. I, I I have a trowel. I have a why are you, why are you trying to use the not not use the trowel? There we go. There we go. There we go. There we go. Oh the frog. I'll take you. Thank you. Alright. Now let's go make the dog eat. Eepy time puppers. You know that nap I gave you? It's time for another one. See you up here? Yeah, he is. Uh, let's see. Here you go, Bubba. Eat up. Delicious. Give me your hair. And I can't cut anymore, so I'll just take all this too while I'm here. Oh, 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 I want to get those. I have no idea when I'm going to be able to use them. We haven't used those yet, but you know what? The earlier, the better! Where'd you go? Where'd you go? In the abyss. Is there another set? There is. I'm ready! Alright. Now let's go find mill, which I'm assuming I'm going to have to craft another jar. So I hope I have enough materials for another jar. I should probably check. 
I definitely have enough materials for another jar. Let's go find out where we're gonna get our milk from. <sighs> sir, it's okay, you don't have to cry. You're fine, you're fine. It'll be fine, sir, I promise. I'll figure it out. I'm here to save the day and take some souls with me. <gasps> we stealing souls, we stealing bodies. What is this? Lazy grass? Well, I didn't realize they named a grass after me. Okay. A bit rude. Didn't even have to tell me first. Uh, milk. Milk. Where am I gonna find a cow? You're not a cow! <laughs> okay! Hey, buddy! Uh, I'm not gonna talk to him yet. I think he starts another quest, if I remember correctly. I don't think I have to talk to him in order to figure out where a freaking cow is, either. Ooh, I'll catch you, though. Nice. Uh, is there a cow anywhere? This looks like- Hey! Uh, we- uh, quiet. Keeps to herself. Oh, okay. Uh, do you mind if I just have a little bit? I'm not trying to take a lot. Just... Thank you! <laughs> She's so sweet. Um, okay. So... Now I need to go back to the swamp. Alright, maybe I should make sure I, I don't need anything else from here. Okay, I can craft this. That's what I need. And I can craft this. So now all I can do that I know is go to the swamp and figure out what I can do for the dragonflies. Hopefully they don't need anything from here. I forgot what it said I can- oh, meat steak, right? That's what it said? That the dragonflies want? Oh, and I can make that. Yep, dragonflies, bats, okay. So we have our steak. And now we just head back all the way back. Is there a teleporting I can do? I think there is, but I haven't unlocked it yet. So I'll just have to wait a little bit. Which is fine. It's not a bad walk. We can enjoy this peaceful walk together. Enjoy the scenery. Listen to the leaves. Listen to the birds. Listen to the rocks. Alright, I'm already bored. <laughs> Uh, where is... Is it up? No, it's more up. If I remember right. It's way more up. It's all the way up here. So what do I need to do? Do I need to, like, put the stake down and then, like, hatch it? I'll we'll have to see. I'm on my way, though! Let's see. Um... G. Interact. So I just need to interact with it, and it'll be fine. I want to make sure I'm near one, because it said it can attract a bunch of other things. Um, those are Skeeters. I need to get away from the Skeeters. Oh, hello, lady. <laughs> no, 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 don't talk to me! Who's there? My eyes have gone milky. Please, come a little closer, sister. I don't believe we've met before. Why do you call me sister? I don't need sight to see someone who's also signed a dark contract. The woman looks blindly through you, though you can sense her focus. Contract. So you've had dealings with that damnable goat too. What sort of pact did he rope you into? Oh, you know how it is. I was young and he weren't no goat when I knew him. We used to dance naked under the blood moon and raise the dead to frighten dull country folk. Ah, but it's an ancient history now. Old age comes for us all, and eventually you've got to hang up the sacrificial dagger and settle down into the comforts of retirement. Oh my gosh. I know the feeling. I miss my cozy chair and little fireplace. Seems like a fine spot you've got here. Well, it's not all poises and pumpernickel. She clutches wordly at the moth-eaten blanket in her lap. It's rattled your bones. Maybe I can help? It's my dear old husband. Handsome chap, although a bit clumsy. He had tumbled trying to weed out some swamp traps from the yard. Awful things like to snap at your toes when you're not looking. Anyways, he twisted his ankle pretty bad and went off to the sick house to have it looked at. But that was a few days ago. He should have been back by now. And these lights haven't worked right in decades. So I can't even go check up on him. I've been so worried. I even thought about making another contract. Don't you dare. 
You just wait here. I'll go find him and see what the bother is. Thank you, sister. The sick house is down the road to the west. Be careful of the critters along the way. They've got a taste for blood. New chapter. Okay, we're not going to focus on this. This will be next time. The leech. Yeah, the leech is actually, I think, one of my favorite chapters. Just because I'm a big, like, I don't know why. I like the whole doctor, play doctor, medical stuff. Um, so I think that'll be really fun. Steak! Hey! Hey! Come on, man! Oh, there you are. Hey! <laughs> so, oh, it's reusable! Cool. Oh, and it comes with bug, uh, Iker. Cool! Alright. So, is... I have n that... I need to make that, which I have enough of now. And I can give him the talisman. Sweet. So that's good. So, oh, no, 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 no. I'm not trying to track the quest for this. No, 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 no. Journal the bear. Back to that, please. Um, uh, adding, yeah. Inquire at the apiary. Oh my gosh, I forgot about the apiary in the field. All right, well, since I'm already here, I'm gonna give Sergeant the talisman and then we'll see what happens. Hopefully something interesting. Hello? Anything new happening here? All right, here you go. If I make you a protect- yep, 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 Here you go. Here, this ought to shield you from harm for a time. He grins nervously as he puts the charm around his neck. Then he clobbers himself within the face with his own fist. Wh wow, you weren't kidding. <laughs> Though now, that's nowhere near the kind of punishment the bear can dish out. I better find some more stuff to test it out with. Then I'll give that bear a piece of my mind. He stumbles off into the camp to find other objects to try against his newfound protection, leaving the bear's tent unattended. So he's just banging his head on stuff. All right, you know what? You do you, man. You got that marine brain, that's for sure. Uh, clear bottles. That. Why would you have a bear skin? Meaty morsel. Ooh, yes, please. All right, so we got the bear, the baby bear. And now we need to go to the apiary. I didn't realize there was an apiary in the fields. I totally forgot about that. Maybe I could check the map for it. Here we go. I don't know. We'll have to see. This game is so nice. It scratches the right brain, the right completionist brain. I need to go all the way this way. Whoa! Hey, yo! You don't need to be doing that. Who are you? Lumberjack. Oh, you're the lumberjack. You look like a soldier, or like a bandit. He's out here trying to kill squirrels. All right. So where's this apiary? Map. Uh, what is this? Unusual hay bale? Buried in the hay, a secret of ways to be discovered. <laughs> what? Uh, yeah, so, yeah, that guy was towards the ox. Okay, so, immediately left. It's looking like... Hello. Whoa, hey, turkey. How you doing? Digestive tablets? <laughs> what? Why would I need to hurt you with that? Hey, Beery. Oh, it's its own section. Okay. Well, that's helpful. Hello? How are we doing? Whoa, you look creepy. Hidey ho! I'm afraid we're closed for the season. Closed? But I need some of your honey right away. Sorry, our supply was cleaned out just a little while ago. Funny little man with a cart. You just missed him. Yes, I've met him. He's the quartermaster for the bear. But he had a bit of an accident on the road. I need to collect some more honey for the lakeshore camp. The bear? Well, that explains why the quartermaster purchased so dang much. I heard that that lumbering bully would steal the nectar from a larva if it suited him. My poor bees have already worked themselves half to death for that order, and they don't have any honey left. I wish I could do something to help you, but the only honey left in the entire apiary is Her Majesty's personal reserve. Her Majesty? Why, my sweet spring flower, the jewel of my crown, the golden sun of my... Yes, yes, get on with it. My beloved queen, she's as lovely as she is wise and resides over her flowered kingdom. 
Ooh. A shrill voice pierces the meadow and sends chills down your spine. Slave, where is my dinner? I order you to bring me the finest sunflowers. Right away, my love. <laughs> and make it pretty this time. I don't want another one of your dandelion bouquets like some common wasp. Yes, yes, my sweet. Hmm, I think I'd better have an audience with this queen myself. Where is the queen? Hello? Ooh, 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 yeah, please. More materials, please. Yes, give. Give, give, give. Whoa, whoa. The bee. Flower petal. Oh, there she is. Dang, hot mama. How you doing? You looking good. The regal insect looks down, her curled nose at you scoffly. That fool beekeeper is supposed to stop the rabble from trampling my delicate garden. Garden. Good help is so hard to find, isn't it? And I suppose you've come to lend a hand. No, I don't think so. What do you want, little beetle? You seem like a very busy woman, so I won't waste your time. I need honey. Your best honey. She tilts her head, her long neck back, and lets out a buzzing laugh. Ha! Do you think I simply give my carefully cultivated riches to just any commoner? Do you have any idea how much time and energy is spent managing this colony? Everyone always wants something, but no one ever wants to work for it. Chuff! In a rustle of petals, the beekeeper comes running over, holding out an assortment of beautiful prairie flowers. My darling sweetheart, I offer you the finest meadow flowers. I hope you find these to your liking. Is this? Is this a marigold? You wax-brained fool. You know I despise this stuff. How many times must I repeat to myself? Get out of my sight, all of you. My love, I have wronged you. Let me try again. You follow the beekeeper in a short distance away, while he busies himself picking more flowers. She seems to be in a foul mood. Does she always treat you like this? Well, yes, but it's really usually my own fault. Sometimes when she really gets her venom up, a little bit of smoke and soothing herbs calms her right down. Smoke, you say? I'm sure I could come up with something to even out her mood. Some fumes to fit for a queen. Royal essence recipe. All right, all right, you little biatch. Uh, is this your honey? Can I just like chop some out? Let's see. Uh, ooh, which spice? Wait, hold on. All right, we need smoke bomb. Which spice? Sleepy. I can't make sleepy. Can't make sleepy. Okay, so I gotta fill that up. I can make witch spice right now. I can make a smoke bomb. So I just need to make eepy meat, and then we should be golden. Yeah. So I need to go fill the jar up, and then I sh have the yeah. I just need to fill the jar up, and I should be good. I'll be back. <laughs> Gotta go all the way back to the well to fill up some jars. Okay, that's fun. What a lovely lady. What a lovely bee lady. She seems nice. I would love her to have her as my queen. Bees are so cool though. Yeah. I think uh, bees are one of the more interesting insects out there. Not a lot of them are as intelligent as bees in my opinion. Here we go. Alright, let's try some stuff out. Wow, there's a lot of mounds here. See, I'm happy I do this. Because I know I'm getting the materials I need for the future. Look, I get free frogs too. And that noise for capturing frogs is so satisfying. Boing. Uh, should I fill up both these pots? Why not? It's easier that way. And that's all I need, right? Let's see. Um... And that's it. Now I gotta walk all the way back. I gotta walk all the way back. I hate it. I'll take this piece of wood though. I need like a car. I need a fly. I need a bicycle. I need a tricycle. Give me a unicycle. 
something. Something that cycles. I'm fine with it. So these turkeys are mean, it looks like, too. Oh yeah, they're mean. Get away from me! Please, no! I'm innocent. I'm just a bird lady witch. I got your incense, you psychopath. Here you go, you crazy lady. Do I just ignite it for her? <gasps> Who hurt me? What the frick? What did I do? Light it. Oh. Wait, 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 what do I do? What do I do? Oh. You sneak. Do you honestly believe that your little puff of chew smoke can can the queen fans herself lightly as the world begins to push and pull all around her. Whew. Does anyone feel else feel a little hot? Anyways, as I was saying, you can't just just the sparkling sun bears down on the queen like a warm summer's embrace. My look at all these beautiful colors. Have they always been so bright? The queen bee stretches her arms across the sea of flowers, brushing the tips of her petals of their petals gleefully. She arch she arcs her limbs through the myriad of colors swirling about her head. It's gorgeous! Oh, oh, and what's that delicious smell? Cracking into the waxen walls of her hive, the queen pulls out a golden honeycomb. She proceeds to messily stuff the, the honey into her face. Mmm, delectable! Oh, it's so good! You simply have to try some, my dear! I've never tasted anything so delicious in my life! She offers up a sticky handful to you. Why, thank you, my queen. Hey, look at that. We didn't even steal it. She just gave it to us because she's high. <laughs> Sweet. So that's all the ingredients for the bear brew. Is that going to poison our big boy bear? I hope so. Hey, turkeys. Oh, so angry. Oh, so angry. Oh, you're pissed. So how many health? I'm going to wait until I'm one heart for the mending poultice because I don't really want to waste it. Um, just one heart's fine. It's not gonna kill me if it's one heart missing. I don't even know what happened. I think I just stood too still next to a douche bee. Let's click that. Uh, boink. Thank you. Uh, boinky. Spoinky. Thank you. I got all the ingredient grooves, Mr. Berry Boo. You're gonna love this mead, I'm telling you. The frothing basin of brewery stands ready for the right ingredients. Honey. As you squeeze the honeycomb with your bare hands, thick, rich honey slowly oozes into the brewery's tank. Too sweet for your taste. But then, this potion is not for you. Uh, alright, let's do metamorphosis. You ladle out a good portion of the writhing, tar-like substance into the brewery. To be safe, you add a little bit more just for texture. <laughs> uh, okay, and teddy bear. You pause before dropping the tattered plaything into the brewery. A glint in its button eye, in its button eye reminds you of something, but the thought soon evaporates from your mind. You overturn your palm, and the stuffed bear splashes down into the concoction. It floats sadly for a moment before becoming waterlogged and disappearing under the surface. With the addition of the final ingredient, the brewing equipment is sealed and set to work. Steam hisses from rivets and its swollen metal belly clanks and rattles. Before long, the waggling fingers of the ga gauges and dials settle down, indicating that the brew is complete. You give a quick sniff test and recoil at the sickening sweet vapors. You push an empty wooden keg under the contraption, under the contraption spigots, and crank the release valve. The brewery strains under the pressure and fills the keg with chunky, oozing fluid. May not be the finest honey meat around, but hopefully that great raging galoot won't stop to notice the difference. We got it! We got it! Here you go, bear! It's nice and delicious just for you! I was like, oh right, so I pulled my sword out. Oh, okay. Wait, how do I give this to you? Ah, 
Ah, Captain, I've brought you more honey mead. The bear swipes up the tankard with his massive paw and tosses the contents into his slavering maw without hesitation. He licks his chops, savoring the peculiar flavor. With a sudden jerk, he bears down on you with suspicion. Say, this tastes kind of funny. What did you do, soldier? It's an, uh, a new recipe. I thought you might enjoy something with a little more sting in it. Urgh, you know I hate new things. I'll teach you to mess with my favorite brew, you hayseed. The bear is upon you with frightening speed. He raises the huge mace in his paw skyward, and you brace for the impact. With an equal measure of speed, the sergeant leaps between the crashing mace and your head. You peer through your fingers as a great clang resounds through the camp. The bear roars furiously as his blows is magically repelled from the sergeant's talisman. The mace goes spinning out of his paw and falls into the lake with a great splash. He gapes, dumbfounded as the sergeant stands before him, completely unharmed. Let's go, sergeant! Ha! That'll teach you to pick on us, you big oaf. This has to be a long time coming. The sergeant wags his finger at the bear. Who do you think you are, huh? You think you're so big and tough with your fancy feather hat and your big honking club? Well, look at you now. The camp soldiers gather to witness in stunned awe. Miraculously, the bear seems to shrink in the face of the sergeant's onslaught. If it was up to me, you'd be dishonorably discharged for disorderly conduct. You're a disgrace to the uniform. You're no captain of mine. With fear welling up in his eyes, the bear shrinks and shrinks until he is reduced to the size of a small cat. And another thing, I, uh, what's happening? He's tiny! Oh, he's a teddy bear! In the place of the bear's drunken grimace is the stitched smile of a doll's grin. Two button eyes stare back at the disapproving faces surrounding the little plush toy. The sergeant takes a step back to reveal the small shape of a stuffed teddy bear where the brute once stood. Your transformative potion has finally done its work. Gee, I guess I overdid it? He scratches his head in a, a befuddlement, but seems genuinely relieved. Hey, Sarge, I guess that means you're in charge now, right? Oh, y yeah, I guess it does. Well, what are you all standing around here for? The camp's a mess. Let's get to work. Hey! Are you okay, bro? <laughs> Chill out. <laughs> what a mess. So much to do. You pick up the dimini diminutive doll and brush some of the sand out of its fur. As you inspect it further, its head lolls to face you. Far within the glassy surface of its button eye, you can barely make out a tiny crimson flame. The trapped soul of the bear. This ought to be what the old goat is after. I hope he's happy. Cool, so that's it? Yeah! Sweet! That was fun. That was really cool. I love the story of what they do to the freaking, I guess, enemy. Because these guys seem like complete buttholes. Like, that bear was a jerk. I don't know if the other guys are nice or not, but um, we'll definitely see. That was super fun. That's great for another chapter. And the next one we're going to do is Leech, right? Sweet. We'll do Leech um, next time. Awesome. Okay. So that was Witchwood. Um, let's see. What else can we do for our last little bit? We will. I wanted to do this bed we made, but we can save that for like Thursday as well. Um, this bed we made looks really, really fun too. We will do... Um, <laughs> let's do a little bit of Not For Broadcast. Yeah. Not For Broadcast is fun. We'll do that. I love how it like doesn't update whenever I ask it to. There we go. Um, let's see. What do I want to do? What do I want to do? What do I want to do?
Good evening. I'm Megan Wolf. Oh, and I'm Joe like Rose. Our main headlines tonight. Stadion starting! To every single one of you's a bit Jesus. What a wild ride this has been. Well, that's a very blunt question. The advance is lying to you. Friends and neighbours, and have confidence that the team will keep you safe. All right, all right, all right, all right. We're back. What you doing, radio? Sorry, I'm I'm was setting up for stuff. We are going to be doing not for broadcast. Hey, Jury, Juria, Juria. I hope I'm saying your name right. How's it going? Welcome in. It's been a minute since I saw you around, if I remember correctly. Um. Okay. Last time we played was a fat minute ago. Oh, that's not my game. Is this my game? Oh shoot, which one's my game? Wait, where's my save? There it is. Oh, I had a heart attack. I. <laughs> it's been a week. Oh, welcome back, man. Um, yeah, I was showing my friend this game. I was like, day one, ain't no way, because we're on day 2600. But it says the finale, so who knows? Maybe this is actually the little last bit. But we'll see. Hopefully it goes good. Hoping to see some really, really good stuff, really good changes that might happen, but we'll see. I'm scared. I'm nervous. I don't know what's going to happen. But, um, yeah, someone told me that they saw a playthrough where um, Charlie lives. I think it was Medusa who told me that last time I played this game. So, or Charlie dies. And, um, that the revolution wins. So we definitely messed up right. there. Let's try and get through this last one, Alex. Last For one. That's right. I know advance have allowed your equipment to fall into disrepair. It's all gone wrong since they took over. Yep. Not that the alternative was any better. Dangerous bloody psychopaths that disrupt. They weren't dangerous. The show must go on. Well, they were. They one bomb time, stuff. Least. Quick point before you start. We're still having a few problems with the machinery. Locking buttons, screens flickering on and off, sparks and the like. What? I'm sure you'll manage without issue. Locking oh, buttons? Don't forget. You've got free reign of the SFX buttons these days. Make the most of it. Oh, we get free range of that? Cool. Terror alert? No, we're not playing that. I refuse to play it. Let's make this last one a good. Let's make this last one a banger. I've actually gained a year. I celebrated 44 last year. It's actually this year. Brilliant. You're 44. I'm going in five, four. Oh man, this is gonna get three. messy. Good evening and welcome. Spice it up with some audience responses, Alex. I'm Megan. Oh. And I'm joined as always by the inimitable Robin and Patrick. How are we? Well, we have got so much going on tonight. I'm oh. excited. I'd say I'm about a 12, Megan. <laughs> on the excitement scale. Yeah, exactly. We have got so much SoCo stuff coming up. We sure do. We have. I want to make sure the disrupt Jordan stuff is on. Who will be cooking up a storm? Ooh. We'll be announcing the winners of our big competition, Visions of the Future, and we'll be joined by a very special guest for a game of Wheel of Truth. Oh, the button's locked. Wait, what? I can't even click on two. Oh, wait. So it's not even news anymore. <gasps> Let's go. He's actually streaming. We have lived with death, and we no longer fear it. He's alive. That's good. Great for liberty. I can be silenced, but your thoughts cannot. And each day, just like before, we gain hearts and minds, because the truth is like that, irresistible. We're back. And we're only getting started. Let's go! Right, let's have some applause on the way into the next section. ...by Chef Jordan Rankley. But first, we know you love them, so Robin's going to give us an update on our oh, lovely oops. nightly show. <laughs> I'm so messing up! I am the worst live editor! I'm sorry! I forgot! First up, we have 
our hamster lord Cheeks. Now he's a squat winter grey with the scientific name Adipem stultus. What? And he Where is, is he? here with us in this cage. Hamsters love hoarding and they actually have I like hoarding in their cheeks for storing food. He I like storing carrots, food in my cheeks. And chewing tobacco. I should not. Now, hamsters are mm. nocturnal. All right. so I already said it's fine. Not to wake him up. But let's just see if we can. Don't touch him. Leave him alone. <laughs> well, the door has been left open. Um, so, um, it looks as though Lord Cheeks has actually gone for a little wonder. All right, they lost the hamster. But professional. Sure All right, we got a bunch of professionals here. Well, in the meantime, let's say hello to our tortoise. Now, after last month's viewer vote, she is now, of course, called what Slow happened? What's Barbara. going on? Why is the screen just dying? Even it's December, Dude, Advance sucks. It's the worst government ever. Let's say hello. Hey, look at that. He's actually oh, there. Oh, she's sleeping. Oh, Babs. Well. <laughs> oh. Um. Uh, uh. Those are our nightly show pets, Megan, both alive and well. Back to you. Don't forget the SFX buttons. Checking on them or some very similar animals at the same time tomorrow. Now then, I hope you're hungry, because if not, you're about to be. Patrick Bannon is with Chef Jordan Rankley, and they're going to be showing us how to this is a delicious apple pie. They freaking okay. killed the turtle. Go into the kitchen. Oh. Right, and I'm joined here. I have no idea. I'm about to hit boo on everyone now. Welcome to the nightly show kitchen. How's it compared to the kitchens you're used to? Oh, I'm losing views. Ain't no way I'm losing views. Oh, bleeping. So, you own six. Also, this is still not Patrick Bannon. I'm tired of you guys naming this person Patrick Bannon. And you've worked alongside the best chefs in the world. Tonight, you've got me. Oh, are you worried? Am I fucking worried? Are you worried? <laughs> is this supposed to be like Gordon Ramsay? <laughs> is this supposed to be Gordon Ramsay? Dude, they're this is hilarious. So we've got a family over for Leaders Day. They're hungry. We're gonna make them a delicious apple pie. Oh my gosh, yes, they are. Sweetness. It's got the acidity of the fruit and then get the richness of that pastry. Incredible. I love it. Where do we start? So we're gonna start by making our filling. So we've got about a kilogram of fresh cooking apples here. Fucking beautiful. Oh. We're gonna slice these up perfectly. I hate how I have to swear it because it's, it's freaking so good. So, uh, your new show, uh, Demon Kitchen Heart Eater, starts on Friday here on Channel One. So, tell us about that. So, teams of young chefs come into my kitchen, and one by one I destroy them emotionally. <laughs> I teach them some basic knife skills. <laughs> Fuck me, Patrick. What are you doing? What? <laughs> Shit. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck, you lose a fucking finger. I love it. I, I love it so much. Right, so, uh, once we've it. done that, we uh, set these aside whilst we make the pastry. Yeah. Mm. Yep. Yeah. Bowl. Yeah? Okay. Sugar. Yeah. Butter. Yeah. Okay. We mix that together and then a whole egg. Yeah. Okay. What are you doing, you fucking donkey? <laughs> I knew it! I knew he was, she was gonna call her a donkey! Oh my gosh, I need to watch more Gordon Ramsay. I knew! Where's the idiot sandwich reference? I need an idiot sandwich reference now. Okay, that into a nice ball of dough, just like that. So, uh, what does the notoriously fierce Jordan Rankley do to unwind? <laughs> Shit, bed. Yeah. What's that? What is that? Well, it's a bit... Bit lumpy. Lumpy. It can fucking pass for a sack of spuds. Such oh, 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 spicy. Yeah. Pathetic. That goes into chill. <laughs> now, we're mixing our filling. This is hilarious, dude. Apples, sugar, yes. cinnamon. Oh, so, uh, oh, you own six restaurants across five territories. Which is your favourite? Are you mixing that or fucking it? What? Are you going to light a candle? What? Take it out to dinner? To fucking mix it for fuck's sake. Right. Now we're rolling out two thirds of our pastry. Bit of flour into the dish. Uh, and uh, the filling goes next, right? <laughs> oh, 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 disrupt, disrupt, disrupt. Do you remember how it feels to be informed? To feel connected to what has happened in the world? 
Do you remember Jeremy Donaldson? Oh, Jeremy, I, I remember him. I remember how he died. And now I watch this excuse of a program, and I realize he was 100% right. Disrupt's first martyr died protecting this show. Yep. If he could see it now, he'd wonder why he bothered. Yeah, I went from a news channel to this mess. And then brushing the whole thing with a beaten egg. Oh, okay. <laughs> Ta -da! Oh my what god. <laughs> oh my god. You, you, come here. Come here, you. <laughs> That's a disgrace. <laughs> I'd rather jam my eyeballs up my fucking ass. <laughs> I'd rather use my tongue to tie my shoes after the fucking shit kicking contest. Do you understand? Then it goes in the oven for 45 minutes. Oh, I'll put your fucking head in the oven while you're at it. Useless. <laughs> you. Come here, you. You're <laughs> the worst fucking thing to happen to food since cyanide. Do you know oh. that? I tell you what. Fuck off. <laughs> Get the fuck out of here. Fuck off. Okay, well, while I do that... <laughs> Let's go now to Megan and Robin, who will be announcing the winners of our competition. Visions of the future. Visions of the future. Woo! Well, that looks delicious. <laughs> no <laughs> idiot sandwich reference, minus one, one point, writing. but that was amazing. Address envelope, and we'll send you the fact sheet. So, Robin, look at all these amazing entries to the Vision of the Future competition. What is yes, this, dude? This is just a joke. Your predictions of the future, and we were just inundated with entries, weren't we, Megan? From wacky inventions to global problem solving, they are all amazing, and we had the best time looking through each one. It was so tough narrowing it all down, so we had some amazing runners up. In third place, drum roll, please. <laughs> whoa, whoa. We have whoa. Oh, nice! Can I please click on that? Let me click on it! I was trying! I forgot to clap. Perhaps a cat, but I think if you really look, you'll see it's actually a representation of the seeming futility of death through the eyes of the living. Indeed. What? We've also chosen to just leave a lot of it blank, mm. which I think is really interesting. If you know Hamish and his work, of course he he loves focusing on the negative space mm. rather than the image itself. Stunning, absolutely stunning, and such talent from one so young. So, so what is this garbage but music in the background? Our second place entry. So in second, drum roll, please. We have Keith, 41 from Dundee. Whoa. <laughs> Keith, we were sort of aimless towards our younger viewers, but still, he has sent in his idea of the future. That's cool looking, though. Earth. Indeed, he says, and he's really rather detailed notes um deprived of basic resources society will resort to a brutal system oh are those all the notes that's so funny where only the victor may breathe <laughs> he also says it's bottom here either that or about the same but maybe a bit worse I really love his attention to detail. You can see the sort of gladiatorial arena, and then what I can only assume is Keith himself pulling off this chap's head and shouting, um, Come back to me, Linda! Oh, Keith. My Maybe gosh, <laughs> what? Bro's going through a rough breakup. <laughs> and finally, of course, it's time to reveal our winner. All our runners up will receive a day out at an inflatable happy land on an industrial state just off the A40. Sorry about that, Keith. <laughs> but our lucky winner will win the chance to spend the day at the Department of Change to see how our teammates are actually making the new future of reality every day. And the winner is, oh, drum roll, please. <laughs> it's. Oh, I'll help you with that. <laughs> hey, look, it's Mike Wazowski. Spent my whole life searching for truths. Oh, here we go. Sometimes I found them. The times I've not been so lucky. I used to rant about belief juice, a belief drug in the water. And I was wrong. I admit that. It's not in the water. It's right here. In this screen. In this show. This is your belief juice. You drink it nightly, through your eyes, and it makes you stupid and asleep. Hey, man. <laughs> in what I can only assume is an ominous sign of things to come. 
Alhamdulillah. Well, if our winners have inspired you to make some artwork of your own, do keep sending them in. And yours could be displayed in our gallery here. Well done again to everyone who took part. We're going to take a break now, but when we come back, we'll be playing The Wheel of Truth and making some lovely homemade gifts. Don't go away. We'll be back after this. That's the break. One minute oh. back. Oh! Right. What I can tell, the machine's getting a bit worse for wear there, Alex. I expect your kids will be going downhill a bit more in this next segment, so be careful. Dude, it's going to get Don't worse? Don't take any unnecessary risks. To be honest, I handed in my notice this morning. You're quitting. As long as it finishes, the rest doesn't really matter anymore. Also, the viewer also went down. We don't max out on viewers anymore, and I still got an A+, plus, meaning that like, I did my very best. Dang, man. So this is the last bit. I really wonder what's going to come out at the end of this. Oh, it's so sad. What the frick is this commercial for? Rainbows. No rainbows in sight Dude. over territories three and four, as a category two storm warning means we advise our residents to Calling spend their leave places as we that had indoors. country names before Though territories sure three, four, five. Territory three, I hate that. Their lucky stars for an excuse to stay Daily home. births twelve. Though of course, nothing to do with stars. More of a hot air, cold air thing. Next, this front of warm smiles heads across Territory 5, who are still snow. under a blanket yeah, of snow. Again. Surely there'll be celebratory yeah. snowmen. Oh, tonight. the police are there again. Wait, what? Oh, can you all send to keep it down a bit? And Jenny, Territory 7? I'm not sure about this. Grandma was stuck in the Daily Burst 146, look at that. Yes. Grandmother's arsehole. That's much better. Whoa. Apparently there's been some sort of disturbance in the studio. Now I'm sure it's nothing to worry about. I wanted to let you know that I've asked for extra security and they're already on their way. Something's near the studio. Something's gonna happen in the studio? Whoa, that's nerve wracking. Who's gonna, who's gonna start us off? <laughs> wow. Alex. Oh. Oh, I don't know. I think I could wait. Well, here it is. Fresh out the oven. Oh, wow. Oh, oops. Well, let's just say that pie's got more crust than my grandmother's arsehole. Well, thank you for that. Well, come on, try it. Dig in. Okay. <laughs> oh my god. Oh lord. Is it good? Oh, oh that's yummy. Something Patrick. That's delicious. Yeah. Really something delicious. But now you better go and get ready for that next feature. <laughs> Why didn't they just give the pie that freaking like Gordon Ramsay made? Wheel of truth with our celebrity guest. But I know what you're thinking. Uh Megan, we've only got one celeb guest. <laughs> we'll observe you as well observed. Well then, I'd better bring her out. Should I? The surprise guest, what do you think? Here she is, best-selling author, lawyer, and thinker. I mean, she's only the bloomin' thing later. <laughs> it's Julia Salisbury! No! No one wants her. Of course, she's wearing the color of the government, too. Incredible. I was just about to say the same thing. Now, don't get too comfortable. It's time to head over to Robin and Patrick as we play Wheel of Truth. Has the audience gone to sleep? Remember the effect button. You guys are going to see the effect button. Let me do what I want, bro. I'm so upset. That's right. It's that part of the show where we pit our celebs against each other to see if we can break them. That's right, Robin. They're going to spin the wheel to pick around, and it could be anything from butterflies to slap my face. They really have no idea what's in store. This is so forceful. Let's give it a spin. Here we go. Okay, it's fact or fib. Jordan, is it true that you've been known to order takeaway for a dinner party and pass it off as your own cooking? Just <laughs> one fucking time. One time. Well, I think if that pie was anything to go by, you did them a favor. Oh, <laughs> 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 
<laughs> the person who ruined and bombed every place has jokes. Saving time during the laundry. Oh my god! Oh. Oh. Yeah, please. As I record this, maybe you'll see this tonight, or next week, or never. It takes a lot to even get these on the air. I can imagine. Relax, rebellion. But don't worry. The fact that you can hear this at all proves it. You're never alone. Yeah, ha ha ha! What happened? Huh? Huh? Resistance? Any snipers out there to get me? This is so cringe. This is so cringe. Yeah, we're constantly laughing over here. Dude, this is awful. I want to get through it so bad. I just want to get through it. This is this is so forceful. Great. You know what? I'm glad she drank it. I'm so happy she drank it. Drink more of it. We love to see it suffer. Yeah, dude, I'm so glad Bozeman's in on it. Bozeman realizes that this is nothing but just like a freaking scam. This is all just a joke. It's painful to watch to see the changes that has happened, but it's so meaningful that I appreciate it so much. With this effect, this is more, Alex. 
right, you've joined me in Crafty Corner, where today I'm going to be ably assisted by Julia. Come on over here. Oh my gosh. I don't know how you're keeping your dinner down. I can still smell that fish. <laughs> well, to be honest, I've had worse. I used to be to Peter Clement's house. Oh, well, I hope you've got your artsy hat on, because today we're going to be making something very close to my heart. It's our little studio. Look at that. Isn't it adorable? Oh, all of us there on the sofa. Wow. Oh, it's gorgeous. Oh, is there all you in there? Yeah, it is. If we can just get a little zoom in. There we are. Oh, I don't know about you, Julia, but I always leave my holiday shopping to the last minute. Oh, every year. I do it every year. Well, luckily, these make amazing gifts. I'm sure. I'm sure, Julia. I'm sure. We're going to start with a shoe box here. And Julia, that's it. Grab those scissors. I just want you to get rid of this front panel here. Perfect. We will do. Are you big celebrators in your house, Julia? Oh, yes. No. In my house, we show our love through food. What the frick broke? What Dinner. broke? What, what, what part? Right. That's the best bit about any holiday. It's all that food. This bit as well. Absolutely right. Cutting along the line there. Do be careful with the scissors at home. Make sure you're being supervised. It's a bit you tough. Are a child. <laughs> there we go. Fabulous. There we go. Okay, so it's going to look a little something like this. And I've got one here I made earlier. We painted it with a bit of poster paint, white to match our lovely paint, curtains here in the studio, but you can obviously have whichever backdrop you like. Like a nice shiny gold number. Well, exactly like right. So we're going to make bits of our set now to put in the studio, perhaps a little desk. So I'm just going to grab this piece of card. I've just got it from a little cereal box packet. I think you... Oh, all give right. me this one, Julia. Oh, Shall thank I? you so much. Oh, and all you need to do is <laughs> cut along the lines lovely. there. Fabulous. So what's the best part of any leader's day dinner, do you reckon? Oh, uh, I don't even have to think about it. Really? I love the three potato pie. Three potato pie. pie. I don't know that one. <laughs> you know, with the <laughs> chips covered in the mash or wrapped up in a jacket potato. Uh, I just mean it does that. <laughs> I don't know, but that sounds starchy. <laughs> well done, Julia. So now she's folding over a little bit there. What it's going to look like at the end is this little rectangular shape there. We're going to pop it in the middle. A bit of sticky tape on the back there so it sticks down. Now we need a sofa. That's what we need next. We're going to make that out of a lovely paper cup. <laughs> Knock one down there. Knocking it all over. I've got one though, Megan. Good. Fantastic. You're just going to cut along the line here, down the middle. Exactly right. And then when you've done that, around the bottom and again around the top. Well done. When you're done, Oh, there we go. It's going to look a little something like this. And look what I've done there. I've stuck some felt down. Nice and comfortable sofas. <laughs> yes. Can't have our tiny Megan having an uncomfortable sofa, can well, we? Absolutely not. <laughs> She'll be on the phone to her tiny agent and getting someone tiny fired. <laughs> uh huh. Well, there's only mm. one thing yeah, I'm sure. Earlier. What is that? A higher caliber of guests. Nearly, it's people. <laughs> so all we've done to make our little people is we've stuck a cocktail stick into a bottle cap. Mm, we just need a face for that now. Ah, I've got a good one here. I know it well. <laughs> it's me. I'm going to stick it down there. A little bit of sticky tape. Oh, my felt's going everywhere. There we go. Oh, I'm a bit lonely. Let's just take Robin and Patrick over. Do, 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 do. Sitting down on the couch over there. There you go. And well, well, I'll make myself there just comfortable. Well, just, well, I'll make just myself there. Yeah, there we go. Uh -huh. And these, Lovely. of course, are all made and cut out. Well, of uh, new you put her facing in the corner. You could even involve herself. You'd like in a studio. Oh yes. Well, well, I'm going to be playing Wheel of Truth with Ronnie from Heatra. Nice. Yes. But that's good. Um, yes, he's going to be teaching me choreography, and I'll be teaching him foreign policy. Mm. And of course oh, I'm sure you will. A bit, I don't know, nostalgic for the old look of our studio. We've got the blue studio down there. Or even a bit of retro red. I've got Sheila Quickstep. Oh, the old studio, I miss it. Oh, um. Is that Jeremy? Sorry, that's, that's not supposed to be. Oh. Well, we're all out of time, I'm afraid. Oh, is that Jeremy? No, I could have showed it. I'll be on the couch of chat talking to some of you, and I just cannot wait. We'll be back after these messages. She literally made this into her playpen. What's that? Is there a little bubble in the corridor? One moment.
What? Kerfuffle in the corridor? What was that? What the frick is this commercial? What is this? Advancements? She's selling a book now? She's the reason for the extra security. Are we gonna not need it? Possibly. We're back. It's not very reassuring. I know. Oh, oh they're back. Right. The disrupt is back. After much pacing and I oh, A plus. Nothing's happening in this corridor. I settled on the zip back boxy pleated skater skirt in dark blue with white sweetheart blouse and the necklace Harry had given me. Bro is just yapping. Out into frog in my it's an honest account of my childhood, because in the new future. There's no need for secrets. There was just so much injustice in the world, I realized. Is this a Porsche horror game? Hamilton no, but there is like a scary DLC. For this game, you are a like live news How editor. So you bleed the, the words, you cut the camera to the right grad. space, and like it gets political and you choose what you want to show on camera because you're the news. You can experience and a childhood the under the All right, so we're back in. And like me, understand. Well, we stopped them before, we can do it again. Thank you, Sarah. One more thing, Mum. Yes? Apparently, there's chatter about you. I've requested backup, but, well, we're stretched pretty thin, Mum. I receive death threats like other people receive posts. I've learned to take it on with a pinch of salt. <laughs> of course, Mum. Thank you, Sarah. Ma'am or Mom? Is she saying Mom or Ma'am? Is that her kid? What did Bozeman tell you? Tell us what? Oh, I'm sure he'll tell you when the time's right. Forget I said anything. You what? You didn't. Going in ten seconds. What did Bozeman say? Oh, no, that's just how she shows love. Five, four, three. She is so manipulative. Welcome back She's to the so Where manipulative. It's time to get a little intimate with the Prime Minister on the couch of chat. Prime Minister, it's great to still have you with us. Thanks, Megan. Although maybe now's the right time to tell you that you're going to be seeing an awful lot more of me. Oh, my bad. Well, I am delighted to announce that starting next week, I will be the new... Miss Salisbury, could you get ready to accompany me, please? Please remain in place, Mum. It won't take a moment. Please remain in place, Mum. It won't take a moment. Sit rep. Um, well, uh, we do apologise to our viewers. Oh, is it going to get spicy? Sure Ain't no way she's going to be the new host of the show. I would rather Everyone, freaking shove calm. a pencil in my eye. Everyone out of that area. Everyone. Okay, everyone, if we could just clear away from these studio doors. Yep, that's right, just behind the cameras, please. Are those doors locked? Is that Colin with the headphones on? Hey, mate, can you lock the doors? Can you not hear me? Colin! Colin! You can't hear us. I'll do it. No, miss, too late. What's happening? I'll do it. I'm not involved with weapons off! You can stay at the door, lock it tight. The, the disrupt! The disrupt are here! Now, now listen, there's, there's no need for anyone Sit to back get... down! No, we can't make her look good. We can't make her look good. We can't make her look good. Yes, we're live. Good. Yes, there he is, my guy! Time for some real news. Please give us something real. You, mic me up. You, mic is it working? I just need to hear it. Is it working? Well, no need to yell. Good. Come on, you gotta be Over civil. On your You're on live. Yeah. You're on air. You, next one. Move! You. Come on, come on, it's fine, it's fine. Okay, Let's be civil. Disrupt, come on. I've been trusting you, I've been showing your stuff. Let them go, Mr. James. It's me you want. No. Don't flatter yourself. No. You're not the target here. You're just a bonus. Let's go! Oh my god, is it, is it me? We're not here to take out a person. No, we're here to spread awareness. <laughs> no! <gasps> we're cancelling the whole fucking show. Which camera? I know you're watching this. In your vans. Planning your counterattack. Please. Try and control yourselves. Oh. Well, I'm sure you know the rest. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh, we will. I have a lot of questions. There's no need for anyone to get hurt. <laughs> Where was that attitude during the uprising? You know, the night your thugs killed my friends. That's true. Innocent people here. Says the woman who killed 14 million of them. No. You literally dropped four nukes. In fact, get over here. You dropped four nukes. You stupid lady. Don't, don't show that. Don't show that. Don't show that. Don't show that. We don't, we don't need to show that. We got to be on the good side. She killed so many people she disrupt she took over so many countries she's evil uh, don't do it you're not an executioner what am i then eh you tell me megan wolf what the fuck am i just a 
a man. He's just way in over his head. Don't patronise me, you smug bitch. I'm not one of your little helpers. Get over here. Kneel beside her. You're just as fucking guilty as she is. No, she's not. She's not guilty. She sat there smiling and let it all happen. What else did you want her to do? Died for this program. And she let it become this. Bread and circuses. Bread and fucking circuses. Yeah, it is a circus. It's literally a playhouse. I said, don't you say his. That's his name. girlfriend. You're that's his. Do that. That's his ex-girlfriend. You don't want to mess with Jeremy's ex-girlfriend. She didn't want that. You're angry at the wrong person, love. She's the one that killed him. True. I agree. Of her benevolent slaughter. Because she was going to kill him either way. All I am hearing is crazy. And maybe you should hear it from the source. Maybe you should hear it from the source. Confess. I feel like I started watching during season Confess. 17. Yeah, we're on the last one. This is, we've been doing this stream for, or doing this series for a little bit now. Your own way. <gasps> stop! I can't, I can't take, stop! No! That was not supposed to be aired! That was not- I did not want that aired! Shoot! Answer my questions. Or she dies next. Yeah? Then who? Okay. Come on. Dude, Julie- I admit it, Salisbury steak. First question. How did you actually think this was all going to end? In a better world. Bullshit. You were literally decreasing birth rates. When we came into power, everything was broken. The system Wrong. worked for so few that there was hunger and, and poverty and, and real pain. You still dropped four nukes? You never saw that, Mr. James, because you were doing just fine, thank you very much. You were doing just fine, thank you On my side, we were too weak, too meek. It was all good intentions and second chances and, and, and playing by the rules. Well, do you know where playing fair gets the people at the bottom? Fucking nowhere. All right. Someone had to be prepared to, to actually fight to, to do what was required. So I did it. Because no one else was going. You to. started wars. Million. People. You literally killed and decimated countries. Million here. What would you have done? Let us all starve to death. You should have found another way. There was no other way. Is that how Peter Clement saw it? Whoa. I loved him more than I have ever loved anyone, but he was soft. He, ever loved he wouldn't have allowed it to happen. And afterwards, he couldn't sleep for thinking. I think he would have killed him in the end anyway. But that's she on me, killed Mr. James. She killed Clement? That's on you. Dude, she killed so many innocent people and it said that they were bad people. She's awful. She's a manipulator. Then how have we been watching you for months? Watching me. Is there cameras everywhere too? Anyone who knows how to get people on the inside. We knew you'd pop your grubby little head up again, and, and we've been collecting information just in case you did. There's a recording of a meeting of the so-called disrupt leadership. It's kind of a hidden camera. It's very high tech. Perhaps the public should see what your bosses are talking about when there's no one else around. We have people at the network jamming your signals, messing with your broadcast room. We'll stop you. We have people too, and they've been doing this an awfully long time. Prepare the footage on screen four. I guess it's up to the broadcast room. You in there? If you play that footage. I'm not playing that footage. Oh, you know I'm not playing that footage. Play the tape. I've seen it. It's important. Play the fucking tape. Play the fucking tape. I don't want to play it. Oh shoot. Oh shoot. Don't let them play that tape. Let them take those screens. What is that? What's, What's happening? Ha What's happening? Well, how the fuck should I know? Someone tell me. What did they choose? They didn't play it. I didn't play it. I didn't play it, Papa. Well done, Alex. Thank you. Good choice. Thank you. You get to live. <laughs> you not so much. <laughs> you not so much. I choose the right cuts. Why? What do you mean, why? The way it ends with people like her. What do you mean, why? She was. Stop. Someone had to do it. Someone was thinking. We were all thinking it. Her version of what's best forever. She was a narcissist. I'm gonna kill you, Alex. Yes. I know. But the movement will stand a chance. 
we'll all stand a chance thanks to people like Alex. Oh, Alex is a hero. But that's what heroism is. For people like us. No, we want the good back. So we want our old country like back. They, they made it so much worse. Actually make a difference. Mm -hmm. We're so disempowered. I feel bad for my kid. My kid got involved in all this. You know what I'm saying? That defines us. We remake the world one small choice at a time. Better choices. Chance isn't just one person. We're gonna have a new leader by morning. Yes, but this one might be prepared to listen. We need elections. We need a choice. Yeah, there's no elections. Oh, I don't see any of you stepping up. You step up every night. Do you though? It seems to me you stopped doing that a while back. And even when you did, you just took snide pot shots and undermined everything. <laughs> yeah. You, you guys went from a freaking wrong, good news channel and hopeless to a nightly show, to a nightly girl show, girl talk show that she was gonna host. Go go. <sighs> Nobody move. Whoa. You know how this works. You know how this works. Whoa. Whoa. I keep my thumb down on this. We all get to have a peaceful night. Megan, come here. Yeah, Megan. Go give him a kiss for me, please. Give him a little smoochies. Mm -hmm. Shut the fuck up. Don't you even want to know who's pulling your strings, what they say about you behind your back? I said. No, you're stressing him out. I think it's a joke. Alan, they're using you. I said, shut up. And when you've done what they want, they're gonna throw you to the wolves in the tape, Alan. See what everyone else sees, Alan. You're a joke, a nut joke, a sad, pathetic. Shut up! Sad, pathetic. Shut the fuck up. Okay, now I'm so confused. Was he actually being used this entire time? Should I have played that tape? I should have played the tape. I don't know. Don't blame me. I didn't make the choices. I didn't make the choices. I just played the hand I got dealt. She's gonna let go of it. Yep, he is. Frick! No. No. I feel like I got like the worst of the worst endings. Oh man! Hated in the industry. Okay, Jesus still seeking funding to get to the moon. He also needs scientists and engineers. Yeah, what's gonna happen to the government though? Little sees new album. I don't care about any of these. I don't care. I don't care about these guys. Remain in the embassy for six years and after she has yet to face trial or bother to win Melvin. Returns to dry land, release concept, and the entire journey to the wrong. Scientists were never heard from again. Overcoming life persecution, you know, leading figure. Okay, what happened to our family? What happened to our kids? This was great! I mean, I love the game. This was amazing. But what happened to us and our family? What happened to like people like Bozeman and all the districts? That's what I want to see. Wow, that's so many actors. That's a crazy amount of actors. This was such a freaking cool game, dude. This was so fun. This is probably one of my very first like acting game. And I'm already obsessed. I'm hooked on them. I already have another acting game ready for us to do. Um. But I'll do, definitely do Thursday, because this is really, 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 really fun. This is exciting. I'm actually really happy that we did this. But, what happened? What's happening now with us? Is, are we going to know? Like, what happened to our, our grandmother, or our mother? Our, despite her death, Helena Canterbury Boat Show continues her work. She recently went, what? Oh, yeah, she, yeah, she did die. <laughs> I forgot, that was uh, Lance's person, right? Oh, so we had to sit and wait. Oh, man. That was so good, though. That was so much fun. Learning a lot from this, though. 
So maybe we should have played the tape. The tape would have had a lot more. Maybe it would have told us something. COVID officer? Um, that's something I should have definitely looked at. Telethon. Nice! Fletcher Quartz will or try to do some stuff with. This music too is really good. <laughs> this music. Man! I'm so upset! Take me to the end. Crazy Neil lives in the capital with his ninth and tenth wives! He now sells mostly indulgences. Okay, good to know that Crazy Neil's still doing good with his company. Like, I, I wanted- the main thing I hated was the transitioning uh, buildings. I hated that. I hated that. I hated how, like, everyone had to be equally poor. Then there's to be, like, good and bad, like, high income, low income. Like, everyone was just, like, equally low income. Unless you were, like, Julia Salzburg. She was still wearing jewelry and all that, so she could still afford it. It just makes no sense to me. It makes no sense to me at all. I just... Like, I get it save people from being homeless and all that, because that money's going... But it just doesn't make any sense, man. It doesn't make any sense. I wonder if... Man, I wanna... I wish I could play that tape now. I wish I could go back! But I had to lay in the grave I dug. So good. Good. I'm glad that I didn't, like, go far out. Picture of St. Bumley. The tape continues to thrive. The hole was recently named the area of outstanding natural beauty. Wow. Is that it? We don't get to learn about our family? Or maybe we do? Please tell me we do. Welcome all the boys and girls and everybody else as well to Frankie Bum's Wanky Bum House of Wax. Fun and this is the Wacky Fun House of Wax! <laughs> but where's Doofnut? Let's call for him. He's so red. Doofnut! Oh my god. Are we ready for wacky zany goofs galore? I can't hear you, Doofnut! <laughs> <laughs> Poor yes, Doofnut! That's better. Dude, the <laughs> contrast is entirely like Whoa, maxed out. It's the bonk, the bonk alarm. alarm. <laughs> 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 Poor Doofnut. Doofnut has seen war and gets treated like this. Whoa, 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 whoa. That was creepy. You have unlocked and reached wacky fun. You have found one out of 14 epilogues. 14? 14! 14 epilogues! Wacky fun. I got the weirdest one. The middle ground. Chaos reigns. A better Jeremy. Uh, inevitable advancement. Ooh. Oh man, I get all of these and I freaking get wacky fun. Do evil route. Okay, I see, buddy. I would do evil route. I would. I would do evil route. Um, the only thing is that it took us nine hours. It took us nine hours to get to this ending. I am not restarting. <laughs> I am not restarting. But what, what, we, we, what we will do um, from now on is that we have the extra. No, where is it? We have the additional content. So... Like I said, like, that's our story. We got wacky fun, you know? It was wacky and fun. I made the worst decisions pro possible, probably, to even get an ending like that where it's not even related to the government at all. You know? It was wacky. So, what I'm gonna do now is that we're gonna knock out these um, DLCs next time I get on. Probably Thursday, like I said, because Tuesday's scary games. Unless I do live and spooky next. Um, but yeah, we're gonna do Telethon, Live and Spooky, and Bits of Your Life. Those are gonna be the fun ones that we'll do next. And then I will, um, there's another game I planned on doing that was also acting. If I remember right, I got it a little bit ago. Oh, where is it, where is it? The Isle Tide Hotel. 
I we're gonna get into this one next, and um, yeah, it looks really fun. The characters look really really cool, so I cannot wait to try this game next with you guys because I think it's just so much fun to do the acting games now. It's so immersive in my opinion because you know these are real people, and it's so fun to see them do like wacky freaking um. So I guess like yeah, these will be like our choices and what we do. So I'll be more like decisive. Yeah, it'll be more like this. So we'll actually be more, I guess, interactive with our character. And I think that's just going to be really, really fun. So yeah, this will be our plan Thursday, hopefully. But thank you guys so much for joining. Thank you for being here. This was a great stream. We knocked a lot of stuff out and um, this was amazing. Have you watched Black Mirror Bandersnatch? I watched Black Mirror years ago, so I probably forgot it all. I'm not going to lie to you. I think the last episode I ever watched about Bandersnatch had Miley Cyrus in it or something similar to Miley Cyrus. If I'm not right or around there, I think that's what I watched. Um, it's been a while. They have an interactive one. I did something on Netflix. I did someone on net like a one on Netflix before. It might have been it if that was it. Because I remember doing an interactive. And those are fun. That was fun. I think that was like a gateway into me being interested in stuff like this. Because it's like a really, really specific niche and not everyone's into it, but I think it's just great, especially for community growth and all that. But yeah, I'm ending it here. Thank you guys for such a beautiful stream. Thank you for all the follows, support. Um, thank you for talking with me and enjoying uh, your time with me. And yeah, uh, I'll see you guys tomorrow when I play some scary games. Thank you guys so much for joining, and I'll see y'all later. Bye! See ya!